get it. <laughs> wait, it doesn't go in! <laughs> it doesn't work. No, oh shit, I'm knocking. So wait, I'm breaking the side. Hold up, go again? Yeah, well, you gotta do it right. Hold up. <laughs> I got it. Why doesn't it go? Am I stupid? You might be. Let's see. Dude, I swear it doesn't go in. Hold up. Break this. No. Beep, beep. <laughs> oh wow, that shit is actually broken. Wait, then how the fuck? Did, so the intro's a lie? No, it was Trevor did it. Trevor's better than us. Oh, okay. So. Damn, I was gonna do the whole song. Wait, someone said turn it on. There's no way that makes a difference, right? It doesn't oh, that on. shit don't even work, Wait, bro. It's plugged into it. Okay, um, this is great. Hi, guys. Welcome to uh, the set of Steak and Eggs. Uh, we are live. Chat is here. We can see chat. This Apple ain't real either. I don't know about you. I have never looked behind me, ever. I have never given a fuck about what's no, behind me. No, I never, actually never. We have a little tips card here. How long have we had a baby dragon? Wait, this is crazy. <laughs> this has to be new, right? There's no way we, this is, this is a, this is a plant. Uh. Ooh, made in China. That's how you know it's good. Yeah. Yeah, we're here at the Steak and Egg Studio. We're going to do a bunch of fun stuff today. We're going to cook, give you guys a tour of the whole, uh, OTK studio. We don't just, what is that? Who are these people? It's like Ludwig and one of his friends or something. No, I'm, Okay. All right. No, these have to be people, bro. There's no way they put post up some random motherfuckers. Like, who is this? Isn't that p pirate software? Who's that? I don't know. They're going to say it's Pokemon. I'm like, I don't think so, bro. <laughs> no, that's not Pokemon. <laughs> that actually might be pirate software, yeah. Uh, so, Asmin is uh, on his way. There were about 17 car crashes on his way here. You know, but he'll be here very soon. He'll be here very, very soon. Just tell the truth. Don't worry, guys. Um, he left yep. about an hour ago. Oh. That actually is true, and yeah. he's been in traffic for an hour. So we tried to wait for him, and then we were like, you know what, we're just not going to wait. So he'll get here when he gets here. But he is uh, on his way. So yeah, he'll be here soon. Uh, so yeah, how are you guys? We've never been here before and been able to talk to chat. Wait, Jay, can you show them? Oh, shoot, we're live? Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's right. Hey, look at that. Yeah, so we, we, can, uh, we can see everybody. Must be some bad traffic out there. Yeah, or maybe he like lied about when he left. Would he do that? Yep. As yes, he one million percent would. You no, know why? You know, I actually feel bad a lot of the time because the podcast was like, what? I don't. Okay. Well, the podcast <laughs> is my idea, right? And the location is like an like an hour away from where he lives. Well, yeah. You you know what? He should move. But he's not going to. But he should, you know, and then all the problems are solved. It'll be all right. But can you imagine him living in, like, a, a newly built house or something? Yeah, and I, and he's happy. He's happier there. It'll be good. We're, we're going to make sure that Asmogold moves this year. He's either going to move or he's going to clean his house. He's not moving. Yes, he will. It'll be good. If he, he will move or he will clean his house this year, 100%. If he doesn't, uh, I'll live in a hole for a week. I'm convinced there's some kind of, like virus in his house so, like if you clean it it will like escape oh yeah, oh, <laughs> yeah. it'll be like the beginning of the apocalypse yeah. he's like growing something in there it's a lab <laughs> i'm so for this there's been a lot of shit going on yes i'm most excited to show the studio because um we've never shown the full studio before well actually you guys have seen it before but you probably like didn't realize it's the same place so the room building warehouse that steak and eggs is in is in the same place that lube goblins was we did that really scary chicken wing video in here bro that um, video is dude i i hate how people don't okay where is that the the people who watched <laughs> the video liked the video the people who made the video hated the video i hated the video uh, oh <laughs> i liked it <laughs> i like where i killed everybody it's a abstract piece that's my best theatrical right? performance ever on film yeah we've got a lot of stuff here uh loot goblins School, steak and eggs. There's also some people who work here. That video sucked. Yo, Mods, you banned that guy? I don't like chat that being in my house. Did. This that is like this is like, this is my safe space once every week. And now they're all in here. I still this, can't this it's, is your safe space. It is. It stressed me out because you're not in front of your mic. And we used to have that issue for oh. we we recorded another podcast where nobody was ever in front of their fucking microphone. Another one. Yeah, another one. <laughs> that one was crazy. What's up, noodlers? Man, it's been a long oh time. Oh my god, there's something I want to say so bad. Right? Yeah. Never mind. Let's move on. Yeah. Um, <laughs> anyway, so we were... Yeah. I'm sorry, Jay. So we were thinking um, before Asmin gets here, we could start cooking because we can make him 
some not thin skirt steak and he can try it and see how he likes it, you know? You will lose. <sighs> I, it wasn't even supposed to be a contest. It's going to be a contest. There's no way me and you can both cook a separate steak and it not be a contest. Okay, well, I'll be, I, I have made steaks before. Fuck, do we need to be near this or, or not? I can't even oh, tell. Oh, wait, no, this is a bad habit. Okay, so we don't, we don't, do we need to be on mic, Shay? No, Jake, no? Jake has his own mic. Okay. I was just called him Jake. Yeah, Jake. <laughs> Who's Jake? <laughs> Thanks, Jake. I'm sorry, Jay. All right, where's the steaks? They're in the fridge. I'll uh, get them. Oh, I think I can get them. We're okay. not going to show you guys the set yet Wait. because we're waiting I'll for the tour. Yeah. Wow, Dick Tone just, just letting everyone else... All the staff grab the stuff for you. When you have two perfectly good legs, I say, well, I'm sitting here. Yeah, we got butter, cooking oil, salt, pepper. And then uh, some lemon pepper. <laughs> We've got all the stuff. Yeah, if you don't have lemon pepper, Asma's not going to like it, to be honest. Okay, well, you can make the steak. I can make the eggs. This <laughs> is the easy part. <laughs> oh, what I was trying to say was I have made steaks before. Like, I, I lived with people who like steaks, and I would make them steaks. But I would never eat the steaks. What? Because I don't... Honestly, do we have I lemon don't pepper? Really like steak. We do. Okay, onion powder. Fuck yeah! Wait, look at the spread. Oh, I thought this was cream cheese. Damn, I wish. Oh, unsalted butter. That's all right. We just fucking put the salt in it, and then it's salted. Bada bing, bada boom. All right. Uh, how about we both get to choose an ingredient one at a time, and then whatever one person chooses, the other person can't use. <laughs> to top my t okay. <laughs> okay. Sure. I pick lemon pepper. I pick salt. Wait, oh, that's so fucked up. Yes, I pick the salt. There's gotta be two salts, right? Oh, <laughs> fuck! That's fine. Does it have salt in it? It's gonna have salt in it. Z lemon zest. That's probably almost salt. Uh, let's do, <laughs> give me the A1. I pick the butter. You fucked up. Uh, wait, no, I pick <laughs> the Pam. Why would you pick? You're supposed to, like, counterpick, because I'm not going to pick the Pam and the butter. Yeah, but if you do, then I lose. Oh. You see, you <laughs> double down, then I just lose. I wouldn't do that. I pick the steak seasoning. Okay. Uh, what is this? Worcestershire? No, Asma, don't know what the fuck that is. Onion powder, garlic powder. Shit. Uh, I'll do Worcestershire. I'll make them like it. Worcestershire? Yeah. I pick... Yep. Garlic. Fuck. I'll take pepper. <laughs> pepper and lemon pepper. You want the last one? Okay, now I get onion powder. All right, I picked the steaks. <clears throat> Wait, we're actually doing this? <laughs> no, we're not. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we can try. All right, how are these? Ooh, these look good. So I, th I think Jacob got, um, there's ribeyes, T-bone, and uh, the, the thin sheet. I'll do ribeye. You the ribeye? But I want to do ribeye. We can both do ribeye. It's fine. I feel I feel like we should use I think I feel like we should share ingredients. It's a bit hilarious. It's a Brit hilarious hearing Americans try to pronounce Worcestershire. It's it's Worcestershire. That's the correct way to say it. Am I crazy? I really don't know. Okay, that's what I thought personally. Am I nuts? Is it not Worcestershire? <laughs> oh, look at these little pictures. Of Asmund Tips in, in Techie. Oh, wow. wow. That was my favorite episode. Gang. Why? Because I wasn't there. <laughs> <laughs> that was such a good episode, actually, bro. Talking to Tips was insane. I learned more. I'm sad that I wasn't there. I know. I learned more <laughs> in an hour and a half than I've ever learned in my entire life. Bro was actually a genius. All right, yeah, let me get a ribeye. I Let's only saw two clips, and they were the ones of uh, uh, Tips uh, flaming me and Emily. <laughs> and those that? are the only ones. Who's flaming you? Or not, not flaming, but he oh, was okay. like, Emmy doesn't talk. And then he said the thing about Emily that's like not even like. <laughs> that's right. I was Tips, like, what the hell, man? Yeah, Tip still thinks I play Genshin Impact. I think he just doesn't watch our streams, man, to be honest. Tips watches my stream? No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, apparently it's. Was Wait, someone said Wasta? Worcestershire? It's, they don't even know. Nah, it's literally Worcestershire. Uh, what temperature should we have this at? He has it at 420. Oh, so Zai said these are like special plates. It uses vibrations to heat up the pan. It's like you can take it off and it's not hot. I'm being serious. <laughs> but the pan will get really hot. What? And it only activates when the pan's on it. That can, that simply yeah, just it's cannot be Yeah, it's true. called induction. 
No, that cannot be true. <laughs> no, it is true. Oh my god. It's magic. Because the pan's hot. <laughs> Wait, so. Wait, is it like. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, that's hot. And then. Oh my god. Wow, bro. Science. Wait, that's insane. Wait, is this is that like self harm? Uh, well, I was like, let's I find have, out. I have a. <laughs> let's find out. I have Asian woman hands. <laughs> it's not that hot. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, let me get some of that butter. Okay. You're using that one, right? I'm using this one. Yeah. Okay. Well, we can make the steak together, right? Or do you not trust me? No, to help? no, we should we should do a competition, right? Oh, okay. Well, I was gonna make eggs. We can do we can we do both. We can both make steak and eggs. See which one you guys would like more. Am I gonna be the only person who eats eggs? No, I'm gonna eat the eggs. I'm gonna eat everything. I feel like Asman doesn't eat eggs for some reason. Oh, I fucking love eggs. No, I'll eat them. He would he wouldn't disrespect us like that. Yeah, he'll take, he would. No, he wouldn't. Okay, but I feel like the classic steak and eggs is like the runny, uh, sunny side up egg. I feel like he'd be he like, oh no. Yeah, no, he'll eat scrambled. Uh, I'm here. not making scrambled eggs. I need <laughs> a plate. Yo, we got plates. Can I have a plate? Thanks. Go again, dick tone. Uh, yeah, I know. Uh, how are you gonna cook yours? I'm gonna season both sides and then uh, put some butter in the pan. Okay, because I don't want to do mine until you do yours. I don't want you to copy me. What if you copy me? Well, I would not, I'm not gonna copy you. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, Sai. The fuck do I? Oh, I don't need that shit, bro. Put it over there. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> see this? This is gonna make chat freak the fuck out because I'm grabbing my actual hands. Nobody Dude, cares. It's literally cooking tongs. Yeah, I don't need it. <clears throat> Alright, let me get the salt. <sighs> Disgusting. Yeah, the cross contaminate <laughs> everything. Chat, we're very excited that you get to tell uh, Emmy about all the drama with Vosh this week. It's gonna be dope when Asma oh. gets here. It's gonna be great. He, he was man. telling me in the parking lot, he was like, bro, did you see the the Genshin shit that happened, I was like, no, of yep. course I didn't. He was like, oh my god, how'd you not see it? Yep. It's gonna be <laughs> good. Like, I don't know, Techie. Wow, I don't know how I didn't see it. <laughs> it's all over the news, man. Is it really? Yeah, I did a podcast with uh, Mudahar and Nux as well to talk about it. With Mudahar? Yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah. It's a good dude. Okay. I'm scared that I'm... Look, I don't really cook meat that much. Okay. There That's so much salt. That's what everybody thinks. Actually, you're right. I'm doing it wrong. No, but no. no you're right. I'm doing it wrong. So you do like, it then. No, it's because it's a very thin cut of steak. Oh yeah, my god, what is that? That black mold. No, it looks like a dog hair. Oh yeah, it's a dog hair. Or it's eggy. That might be eggy. I carry little bits of fur of him um, around on me. So like. Or that's from the cow. I mean, it's gonna be cooked, right? It's okay. It's fine. It'll be alright. Oh hell yeah. Bro, you're gonna lose your. That sure is a lot of salt. That's weird, because you criticized me for using too much salt. Why are you using the same uh, amount of salt? This is not the same amount of salt. Okay, if you're sure. It's not the same. Okay. Dude, he's delusional. Yeah. <laughs> hey, yo, what up, Asman? Up. <clears throat> That's what I'll say when he's here. <laughs> <laughs> but he's not. That's okay. Yeah, that's okay. I suppose. Ugh. We were literally all three late, so it's okay. Uh, yeah, you're right. Yeah, that shit ain't gonna taste like nothing, bro. But you keep doing your thing, Jay. Which oh, one do you think? It's so thin. Which one do you think is gonna taste better? You're gonna put sauce on it after. I'm not even done, dude. Okay. All right. God, what? Jesus Christ, bro. <laughs> Holy fuck. <laughs> I'm just gonna rip my fucking head off. <laughs> dude, am I like, am I aggressive or something? <laughs> yeah, a little. Mainly with me, to be no, honest. No, because earlier we called Asmund to, like, make sure he was on his way, and he was like, oh, yeah, I'm driving. And then Techie was like, bro, Emmy's, like, freaking out. She's so stressed. <laughs> I was like, no, I'm not. Starts throwing coffee at me. Oh, bro, that smells so good. Oh, my God. Bro, this. Help. There yeah, got you. Oh, what the fuck? So any streamer awards that you disagree with? Anybody you think was undeserving? How do you feel about Kai? <laughs> <laughs> well, why don't you say your opinion first? And then I'll just be like, yeah. 
Me personally, yeah. I think I think Kai Stenhan is the best streamer in the entire universe. He is a good streamer. No. <laughs> now are you gonna say what he's you really the, said before we No, <laughs> he's the best. <laughs> I really don't want to use this. I feel like if I oh it's a steak seasoning. I'm not gonna use that regardless. Okay, good. Why? Uh, I don't know. Use it. You open it, so use it. Mm, H E B Texas steak seasoning. That's right. There were some awards that I disagreed with. Okay, like what? But the, the point is that, you know, everyone has their own opinion. It's just what is probably the popular opinion that wins, you know? That's right. Damn. There was actually only really, like, one or two that I disagreed with. Like what? I don't you know. No, go ahead. <laughs> like, uh... I don't know, like... Like, uh... Yeah, say it. Say it in here. Like, how did Soda Papa not win Best VTuber? Like, yep. that's crazy. I agree. Alright. <laughs> uh, I want... Uh, if I'm using lemon pepper, I have to admit that I'm pandering to Asmund. Because this is what he uses. <laughs> I'm thinking it's more of a challenge if I can get him to like something that he doesn't normally eat. So, for that reason, Sharks, I'm going to not use this shit. If you want Maybe to automatically win. He doesn't even win. eat ribeye normally. Like, this is way more fat than what he's used to. I know, but he, he drowns it in lemon pepper. So the question is, do you want to do that or no? Mm, nah. I already okay. have a lot of shit on this. Uh, it's such a free win. See, wait, well, look at mine. Yeah, you used it. Uh, that's crazy how you told me that I was using way too much. And then no, I said too much salt. Please. You're changing my words. Please don't yell at me. I'm sorry. Let me get more salt. No, I don't. I'm good. <laughs> i use a little bit. No, I won't. Fuck that. Okay, let's get it. I already seasoned both sides. Bro, I'm fucking slow as hell. Fucking grandma over here. Shit, should I get him? He likes it well done. That's But disgusting. that's fucking gross. So I think, nah, fuck that. I'm not going to do that either. I mean, butter. to be fair, he eats those, like, um, like fajita steak strips. From Chipotle. Yeah. Yeah, like, those are medium rare. Those. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to cook a medium rare. If he doesn't like it, fuck him. I'll eat it. Maybe I overseasoned it. Uh, you want my honest opinion? Yeah. I think you're doing great. <laughs> I can't tell when you're lying. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> nah, I think I think you're doing great. Uh, restaurants use a fuck ton of seasoning, but about seventy percent of that comes off after you cook it. Oh, that's true. A lot comes off in the pan. Yeah, so I wouldn't worry about it. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna cook this now, and then Asmund's not gonna get here for ten fucking hours, and then it's gonna be cold, and then I'm gonna look like a dumbass. Alright, there we go. <laughs> The butter's already burning. Oh, fuck this. Nah, it's, it's chill. We're, we're, we're chill. It's fine. Are you sure? Yeah, we're chill. We're chill. We're chill. No, but look at it. Yeah, it's burning pretty quick, actually. Yeah, maybe the heat's too high on these. Oh. oh, I just realized we're gonna cook a steak inside of this place and there's not any ventilation. No, no, no. I, I thought of that already. I okay. asked Jacob, can we cook inside the building? He said, I'll check on that. Wait, but he never answered after he said he would check Ooh, on that. Ooh, well, we're already in this deep. All right. That should be good. Damn, that smells good. Dude, chat's literally all like. <laughs> yeah, that'll be alright. Oh, Cinex typing in chat from Cinex here too in the building. Yeah, we really hi, need to Hi, Cinex. Hi, Cinex. He didn't say hi back. That's alright. We'll be okay. Wait, isn't he over there? Wait, he's laughing. Go ahead. Don't watch what I'm doing. I'm Do your thing. My, I'm letting my pan cool down because okay. I learned from your mistakes. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you see that? That's fucking cheating. How's that cheating, bro? You, you wanted me to go first. Yeah, exactly. Oh, bro, this looks insane, actually. <laughs> actually, it looks fucking insane. Actually, it looks fucking insane. Someone said raw, like you didn't put it in. Yeah, we don't need I that. Said... We don't need that tonight. We'll be all right. <laughs> all right. Making sure. Shit is going to be pissed. <laughs> Cook your damn steak and stop watching what I'm doing. I'm just chilling, man. Jesus. No, it's you're watching what I'm doing and seeing what I'm doing right, copying that one. If I fuck up, you're just Why does do everything it. have to be a competition? Because my ego is very small. It smells nice. Doesn't it? Yeah. May I have three more plates, please? You need three, four. Uh, I'm sorry about him, Zai. For three people. I'm really sorry about him. Let's see. Is this too much butter? Yep. Okay. Nope. That's good. Thanks. <laughs> My pan is cold. 
Um, Bro's actually chilling. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Wait, why is it? Wait, why, did, why is it actually stone cold? Why what did bro hell? post up on your pan? Dumbass, I don't know how to eat up a pan. You press the power button? No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you probably pressed the start button. Yeah, it wasn't on. <laughs> well, it said 400. I thought it was. Wait, okay, there it goes. There you go. Let's see. Who's the cameraman? It's Jay, of course. Jay, Wait, so. That looks nice. I know. Jay, Shut so. Up. You're a you're a guy who gets shit on a lot. No, not. By me. Oh. <laughs> yeah, for our, I'm like, what are you talking for about? For our for our ads. <laughs> you ever tired of me beat, beating you up in the ads? <laughs> uh, classic J moment. Chad, type one if I should hit him right now. <laughs> Stop. What is wrong with you? Oh uh, shit. How come you got the bigger pan? I'm a bigger man. I'm always excited for E-Rob to I race. I think I'm a big man, too. That's right, dude. That shit, you, hey, your butter actually don't look burnt. Yeah, but I don't know if the pan's hot enough. It's kind of a lot of butter, maybe not. I think it's good. You should be proud. You're doing a great job. Really? I need Asmin to be here in the next three minutes, or this shit is going to be stone cold fucking cold. Yeah, he, he's not coming. Okay. Dude, imagine if we just started the yeah. episode. So we're like, guys, he's coming. Then he, it's okay. We like knew the whole time he wasn't coming. That actually looks nice. Yep. Yours don't, but it's getting there. The seasoning looks really good. It looks like it's not hot enough. Yeah, I would uh... Well, my, it's getting there, bro. Yeah. You see uh, Last Epoch? No, what is that? It's the new Diablo game. Oh, what? Yep. It just I came out. That. Just came out yesterday. There's also this new crazy survival game I've been playing. Which one? Uh, it's called Epstein. What? So you play, uh, it uh, just came out on Steam, actually. And it's, uh, it's a game where you and, uh... You and what? You and, it's a battle royale. And you and, uh, you and 31 other kids land on the island, you have to kill Epstein. That's a real game. That's a real game! You can Google it, it's a real game! Uh, it's called a survival horror. Uh, uh, um, uh, I mean, that's creative. Yep. <laughs> Dude, the hardest part of, of filming in here is that there's always so many people around that, like, if you make eye contact with one person, it's like it's over. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder if Chad knows about the, because uh, we we can talk a lot about our our memories here. Do you remember the, like, the eight straight weeks where it was 2,000 degrees in this set? Yeah. And you and Asma would still be underneath the blankets and not ruin immersion? I was so comfortable, actually. I was not. I get so cold. I sweat over everything. We know. Damn, that shit looks good. Oh, wait, my butter is browning? No, I'll check it. Well, the bottom is, like, ugh, but it's getting there. Mm. I think I need a double flip. I generally don't double flip. What's a double flip? Uh, let's do that once. Ooh. I'm gonna finish that shit. <laughs> you ever think about what you're gonna do when you retire? I try not to think about that. But do you? Yeah. I think I'm gonna go to Japan. You ever heard of Soapland? That's like, is that one of those like naked bathing places? Yup. Japan's just doing something right. What is wrong with you? So many things. <laughs> but I feel like all my issues will be solved in Japan. Why uh -uh. did my pan turn off? Oh, did the power go out? No. But my steak's not done. Did it? <laughs> They're shrugging uh. back there. The power's not out, all the lights are on. I think specifically for that outlet, the power just went out. I think that it like shorted. Surge for the uh, power surge is powering it, so the light on anymore. Oh no. Oh no. Well, there's your steak. Um. <laughs> there you go, that's you. It's fucking raw. Wait, it's just starting to brown on the other side too. Oh no, wait. I'm sorry, everybody. Is the stream still live or no? Yeah, 
No. No, it's off? It's off. Okay. So now you can say whatever you yeah, want. Yeah, dude, Epstein's Island. That shit is, that game is insane. Wait, All right. Stop. <laughs> what is wrong with you? Some guy puts, uh, Tattoo's gonna get us canceled before the end of the episode, so I'm really trying to fill that quota No, form. I was thinking about that. I was like, because it's live, we can't do the thing where it's like, can you edit that out? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know, I got, I got pulled over, uh, like three days ago. Uh, for some bullshit reason, by the way. It's on the same street I always get pulled over at for no fucking reason. I've never gotten a ticket. Neither did I for this one as well. But bro pulled me over because apparently you need two license plates in Texas. Do you, have two, do you have two license plates? No. You only have one, right? Yeah. Yeah. I only have one as well. I got pulled over only having one. By the way, I saw your parking job. You are fucked up. Dude. I, like, genuinely have, like, no excuse for, like, I really don't know how that happened. And I read one of the threads, and someone was like, how does this happen? And the reply was, like, narcissism. And I was like, bro, I'm imagining yeah. fucking up so bad that people just think you're really full of yourself. <laughs> yeah. Like, no. Okay, wait, do we, we got power back. I'm Are letting you know, no. we both Dude. cooked in the same situation. I told you to cook faster. I feel like you should present that as such. Dude, you're fucked up. Stop. Dude. It's not done. Your smell's really good. Yeah, I know. Oh, here we go. Yo, Jeff. Hey, there we go. Jeff, which one looks better? Bro, mine's not done. Mm. Hi, Jeff. What? TV. Our TV turned off, too. Oh, shit. That's okay. Hi, Jeff. Hi. Uh, Jeff, you got me. Okay, Jay, get this. Ready? Yeah, I hate that we have those stairs and we never use them. Do we have a clock? Like a TV I'll stick on the clock? Yeah, no, because when we right? started, we were yeah. like, oh, every guest should come on. Yeah! Yeah! Yeah, those, uh... Those are steak. You don't think this one looks good? I see why you guys order Uber Eats, like, every day. No, shut the fuck up. I don't order Uber Eats. Bro, you know this shit actually yes, you looks do. insane. No, I don't! I order Uber Eats every day. I don't. You, you, work? you know what? That's. You hurt my feelings. You don't this doesn't look. You it, think this okay, doesn't look good. to be fair, it, it doesn't look that bad. What the fuck? What, what, what's wrong with it? <clears throat> You're holding. Then you hold it. <laughs> you tell me how it looks. Okay, see? Damn, that grease is It looks a little better, thing. right? Damn, <laughs> oh, bro. The grease is seeping. Yep. That's right. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. Yeah. It's coming out the bottom. <laughs> That's a lot of butter. All right, we got paper towels. I made like a steak. You haven't, even, napkins, you haven't even tried on look, it. On looks, bro. On looks? I haven't tried a lot of things, but I have to look at a lot of things. We got paper towels? Oh, okay, cool, 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 cool. The TV is busted, bro. Got you. It's old, okay? All right, I need to find a way to make this stay warm. I'll put this shit right here. There we go. We have um, a micro an unplugged microwave you could put it in. It's on the Luke Goblin's bar. I'm not going over there. That's way too far. Yeah, it's, 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 it's like a mile walk or I got it. Yeah, it's a mile walk. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I gotta get started on this eggs now. Is this the last episode of the season? Yeah, this is our last episode ever. ever. Yeah. We're gonna miss you guys. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. oh, fuck yeah, dude. Ew. Okay. Yeah, mine doesn't look right. Yeah, don't. I think it's like the seasoning's all burnt. It is. Yeah, you fucked it up. Yeah, I don't really cook steak. Hey, you made that braised pork the other day. That shit was good. Oh, yeah, I made the barbecue pork for the thing. I was actually really proud of that. I want to ask Asmund this later, too, but I want, to, I want a genuine question. What, what is your favorite, like, moment that ever happened for steak and eggs over the past one year? My favorite moment? Favorite moment and your favorite guest. Favorite guest? Yeah. Um, my favorite guest is probably... Nanners, actually. You can't. Huh? That was my answer. Well, then maybe she's just that good. Yeah, I don't know. Why can't we have is. the same answer? We need to get her again, man. We need to get we need Nanners and Ethel here for one episode. Oh, that would be that would be sick. Okay, I'm gonna start on the eggs. Oh. Okay. Go ahead. Yeah. Uh, do we have a? Uh, we have spoons. Or a or a whisk. Why do you need a spoon? Oh, I guess I make my eggs a certain way. I shouldn't use plastic spoons, but I appreciate the thought. Okay, I'll use a... Uh... Yeah, 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 yeah. When the fuck is the Russell episode? Never. Oh, yeah, um... Never. Uh, 
Mine don't look right. Yeah, she looks really fucking gross, to be honest. But it might be good. What? I don't think it looks gross. It doesn't look right. It smells good. Okay, so I would like you to not... I would like you to promise me you will not cook your eggs like I'm going to cook my eggs. Are you just going to do sunny side up? No. Oh, well then I was just going to do sunny side up. Okay, great. Easy. Bro, <laughs> my hands, dude. Yeah. Right, I think it's I know. It's the tremors. I'm dying soon. I'm going to make... <clears throat> That's really scary. <laughs> That's really fucking scary. I'm gonna make this shit to where Asmund has to like this shit. There's no way he won't like these eggs. Holy with... fuck, that's a lot of butter. Exactly. That's a lot of butter. What is he gonna say? I don't like this? There's no way you can't like this with this much fucking butter in there. Sure there is. No. He's gonna taste that shit and he's gonna say, wow, that shit tastes good. That's a lot of fucking butter. Oh yeah, man. <laughs> oh yeah. Uh... He will eat these eggs and he will fucking like this shit. There's no way. I'm mean, gonna use a fucking full pound of butter. Bro, I wish y'all could have seen Jay just went like and like looked at <laughs> chat to like see what people were saying. Dude, dude, Jay, will you try these? One bite? Why the fuck not, bro? I'm gonna die. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. You know what's crazy? This looks crazy to you. This is how they make them in France. Okay. Yep. This is, what they, this is how they have eggs. Eggs to them so are like a delicacy. Are, are we in France? Are no, you French? No, but what I'm saying is, you ain't gonna die. You just make this, they make eggs borderline as like a dessert. You see the way they make croissants, that bro. That sounds really gross. I mean, I believe it's good. Okay, try a bite then. Try a bite and tell me it's not good. I will try it. Good. And then you'll say, oh, it's because there's a lot of butter. Yeah, that's the, that's the whole fucking point, man. Okay. One pound of fucking butter. You just splattered it all over <laughs> yep. me. My pants. No. I think my favorite steak and eggs moment was, uh, there's this. <clears throat> best superpower. <laughs> Erase time. <laughs> that was the best one, dude. Stupid. Oh, it was so good. I but... liked when we were in the treehouse, but then I, I don't even know if this was in the video. I got kicked out of the treehouse because there's a sign that says no girls allowed. Yeah, that was, I think that was a Twitter like, post. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah, dude, the Asman House episode, that one was fucking wild, dude. Like, oh, frick. Yeah. God damn it. That is something else I would have, but actually, what I've never asked chat before, What? where is somewhere else y'all want us to take Asthma and Gold? Because <clears throat> what I would love to do is take Asthma to, like... The doctor. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Asthma, you have two weeks to live. <laughs> <laughs> no. This is going to be great content, guys. <laughs> <coughs> we can take him to a spa. That way he has to shower. We went to the nail salon place. Yeah, but like a full spa. That'd be so much fun. But we all go to group therapy. Group therapy? And yeah. just film it the whole <laughs> Yeah, time. film it, post that shit well, live. Well, we talked about having um, another Dr. K episode, but like a... Oh, that'd be sick. A fancy one. He's cool. He lives nearby. All right. <coughs> Yo, get on the eggs, bro. What are you doing? Well... I like to eat my eggs fresh, and they don't take that long to make, so I was kind of waiting, you know? Okay, so what the fuck? All of these are filthy. <laughs> yeah, I recommend using the clean ones. I will go get more. All right. Yeah, more. No, he used all of them. He used, like... No, I did not! He used, like, ten I eggs. used... I ate. I, there's more. She there's. like, are you sure there's more over there? There you go. What? Look. I hate you. See that? Look what you made her do for no reason. Dicker room. There you go. Fuck. Dude, you suck. Yeah, that was an accident. <laughs> That's my bad. I, for some reason, I thought they would stay together. Uh, my bad, guys. Sorry, I'm white. All right, here we go. Boom. Damn, that shit looks good. Wait, so you, you just, like, mopped it up from the pan? Yep. You want me to do it? You got it. Don't turn it on before you mop it. I'm turning it off. Oh, okay. God, you think I'm fucking stupid or what? No, I don't. <clears throat> okay, that shit looks good as fuck. Ugh. Disgusting. Ugh. See that? Okay. Here's your eggs. Thanks. Um, <clears throat> this is really gross. I think that'd be another really fun episode would be to, uh, we all work a customer service job for a day. Like, we all work at McDonald's. That's been my dream. Actually, me and Emily are doing that uh, later this month. Oh. Well. <clears throat> you can come if you want. I can come? Yeah, come order, come order some food for us. Oh, okay. 
We'll put you to, to work in the kitchen. Which restaurant? Um, I think we're announcing it soon. Oh. <clears throat> is it McDonald's? No. P. Terry's? In and out? No. Is it underground or is it mainstream? It's underground, bro. Oh, uh, okay. Have you been to a uh, Not a Damn Chance Burger? No. They serve A5 Wagyu burgers. All right, this really does not look hot, and that's really upsetting me. Why is that not hot? I'm going to touch it. Okay, you, it's hot. Can you put your finger all up in there? Yeah, it's going to cook off. All right, let me bump this with the high. All right, man. So is, is this like a prank? Like, is this like did Asmund die? Maybe. Has he messaged you? It's been like an hour and a half. No, it hasn't. I called him like a minute before we went live. Okay, and he was safe? Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay. How the fuck is he getting here? He doesn't have a car. Oh, she... I wonder if his car broke down again on the way here. That's what I'm saying. Like, how is he getting here? He was well, driving... One time he Ubered. Okay. <clears throat> I mean... Uh, you know what? <laughs> He'll pick up. He's not gonna answer. Hey, I'm, I'm literally about to pull in. <laughs> oh, I was gonna ask if you were at Wendy's. Well, Say Tectone what? was. I was gonna, never mind. Uh, Tectone thought that oh. you died. Oh, I wish. Oh. Right, I'll, be, I'll be there in a minute. Okay, <laughs> bye. He's not dead, guys. Cool. See, everything's okay. All right, good, good, good. All right, so you need to get your eggs done quick. <laughs> that pan does not look hot at yeah, all. Yeah, why the fuck is it not hot? <laughs> No, it'll heat up. It's fine. Eggs, eggs being cooked, this is fine. You could put some water in there and make egg drops. Did I press start? You were just shitting on me. <coughs> you were shitting on me for that. Well, I need a cough drop. <sighs> it's the black plague. It's spreading. I'm just saying, how the fuck did it melt the butter while off? And then it couldn't cook the egg. I don't know, man. That doesn't make any fucking sense, bro. Because it was already hot from when you cooked the steak. Stop using the plastic spoon. Oh, I don't have a fucking metal one, man. And the, the pan was, it was it's cold. It's a non-stick pan. Yeah, it's non-stick. What does that have to do with anything? Because you, you, you would scrape off the coating. So I can just use a fork? What? Wait, how no, do I- You're not supposed to use metal on a non-stick pan. Oh. So I should use plastic. Well, yeah, but not a spoon, ideally. Oh, oh, yeah. Shit. Oh, sh wait, where'd you come in from? <laughs> what the uh, fuck? It's another door. Because oh, the other one was closed. Oh, my fucking God. So, what happened, man? Oh, uh, well. We're live. Yeah. Why do you sound like you just ran, like, a, a, a marathon? Did you run here? No, I, I didn't. I, I, was in, I was in a car. I was driving for, like, an hour and 20 minutes. I thought it was at your house, Emmy. I went over there. Stop. Wait, no, you didn't. I did. I did. Uh, oh, no. It's been a, it's been a no, long time. No, wait, oh. I feel so bad. I think that's fucking funny, to be honest. It was, it, it'll be funny tomorrow. <laughs> you know? Wait, that explains so much. I yeah, was like, how is he not, bro, what are you doing? What? You got salt from above. <laughs> that way there's a better spread. All right. You ever had eggs before? Egg? Yeah, I've eaten an egg before. You like egg or no? <laughs> no, not really. Okay. Why do you have to season it What's from that? that high up? Uh, it gives a better spread. Oh, really? Oh. Yeah. You're spreading it on the table, too, then. Yep, that's right. Oh, God. Wait, will you try this ribeye that I made that looks off? Sure. <laughs> I haven't tried it yet. Oh, so I'm, like, testing it to make sure it's, uh... Well, it's a competition for who has a better steak. Oh, okay. Because you made us steak. Now we got to return the favor. <laughs> okay. Just make it clear, I, haven't, I don't really make steak and I haven't made one in like four years, five years. Make your eggs, because you need eggs. Oh, shit. All right. <clears throat> this is fine. One at a time. Okay, but to be fair, is there has there ever been a steak that you ate and you're like, this is awful, or is it just all steak good? Well, all steak is good, 
I would say this one is a little bit above the middle. <gasps> Woo! You know? There you go. Wait, try Tectones too. It's not as good as my steaks, but it's okay. I'll take, I'll take mm -hmm. that. Here, okay. Uh, here's my second. You can try it with or without a one. Okay. <clears throat> oh, I forgot to get him the the steak sauce. Right, that's a it's lot okay. Of I'll, I'll take. I'll have one without it just to make sure it's fair. Yep. This is some fatty ass fucking steak. God damn. Yeah, make sure you go. Make sure you go buy it. Yeah, I'm gonna... Oh, shit, we don't have a spatula, I just realized. <clears throat> I think that yeah. Tectone put too much seasoning on it, and oh. Emmy put not enough. Yeah, so, so, yeah, <laughs> so, you thought. <laughs> so, which one tastes better, you think? <laughs> Um... Hold on, but try with A1 real quick. Let me know if that makes a difference. Okay, okay. Yep, yep. <clears throat> I put so much on, though. <clears throat> Let me have one of Emmy's with the A1. Okay. To compare. Bro, these eggs are fucking fire. Can I have some? Yep. Yeah, there you go. That's how normal humans eat that. That tastes like a restaurant. Yep, that's good shit, right? Jay, you want to try them? Wait, those are like actual restaurant eggs. Here, I got you, bro. How'd you make them so fluffy? Uh, they, right? I teach you. There you go. I feed you like a baby. There you go. Try that. What do you think? Is that fire? There it is. It is a little more salt, but it's still good. I agree. Yep, it means it's better. Okay, well. But, 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 it's like just a bit better. It's not like crazy. Let's any, go. What are you giving me that yellow shit for? Eggs, bro. <laughs> <laughs> uh, there you go. Just a bite. Just a bite. There you go. Anybody you want. You'll like it. All right. Don't waste forks. Uh... It's not as good as a steak, I tell you that. <laughs> <laughs> That's a fact. Yeah, but is it, all, is it all right for eggs? I remember I was seven years old. Okay, here we go. Um, Ratatouille. <laughs> my mom made me eggs and I was playing Super Mario World 2 Yoshi's Island. Good ass game. And I threw up. <laughs> I threw up whenever I ate those fucking eggs. Yep. And I said, never make me eggs again in my fucking life. Yep. And ever since then, I have never had an egg. Yep. Except for maybe like, you know, something in like a, you know, it's a bit of a little piece or something like that. But this is the first time since I was seven. Yep. And I, I, I told her, I would, she said, That's, you don't mean that. I said, yes, I fucking do. I fucking mean that. Absolutely. And she never did. Yep. So, yeah. Where's the wow. steak? Oh, that, yeah, Where's there the you steak? Go. Yeah, where's the steak? We'll get back to the steak. There you go. It's what I unlocked a core memory, yeah. you know? There you go. I read a two eat his ass. A1 sauce. Thank you. Let me taste my steak, see if it actually tastes like shit or not. It doesn't look bad. It's not to my liking. It's it's, it's too it's too overcooked. Cause uh, Asma doesn't know about the the, the issue we had. Oh, yeah, power, the power power went off. Been cooked. <laughs> so my shit got fucked. Wait, it's what shorted. the fuck are y'all been doing? God damn. Oh, uh, we've been sitting here panicking. Cause okay. we thought we, you were dead for five minutes. <laughs> for five <laughs> minutes, that was real life. Oh man, this is overcooked as fuck. Oh bro, that's fucking so embarrassing. Let's see. Overcooked means it's perfect. Which means mine, it must be nah, super bro. overcooked. Oh, this shit is fucking actually insane. But I'm gonna try much. Okay. Cut me a piece. Yep. Mm -hmm. I'll grab it. Mm -hmm. There you go, right there. 
Yep. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Yep. Thoughts? Mm -hmm. What the fuck? There's no way that shit was actually so good. What do you mean? Oh, wait. I got a better bite. Okay, there you go. I got a piece that was like super dry, no fat, but it's, oh. it's, it's good. Okay, good. Do you need a piece of yours? Hold on. Yeah, let me see what I lost too. Thank you. Mm -hmm. You got my piece? Yeah. Mine is better. <laughs> is it actually? Hold up. I'll, I just I'll, think the seasoning tastes better. Yeah, I'll be straight up. I'll be straight up. It's just the seasoning. It's like crispy. Nah, hell nah. <laughs> Mine's better. I think mine's better. Actually, no, you're right. You're better. It tastes better with the A1. Good. I feel like I'm the only one who's gonna eat these eggs. Oh fuck, are they burnt? Oh, they're just a little brown at the edges. Yeah. <clears throat> this is what I eat for breakfast most days, is two sunny side up eggs and then like toast and avocado or some shit. I just fucking slurp these things up. It's so fucking good. What the fuck? <laughs> Bro, I knew you were gonna have a problem with the, the runny yolk. That's nasty. It's so good. I have to see the steak. It's like an Asian thing, I think. We really like a egg yolk. Do you like egg yolk, Jay? No? I feel like so many re uh, Asian restaurants have the <laughs> egg yolk. I don't know why people can't just be happy with steaks. <laughs> it's like God made steaks. What do you? What else do you want? Why are you being greedy? Where'd this Taco is enough. Go? He went, probably went to the bathroom. Tacto's also stuck in traffic now. Yeah, it was fucking crazy. Like, how the fuck is it 3 p.m. on a Thursday, and it's like traffic's fucking stopped? What the hell happened? Did you see the accidents? No. When I drove, I came up here like an hour before you did. There were mm -hmm. a bunch of accidents. And then also, once I got past the accidents, there were like four sets of traffic lights that weren't mm -hmm. working. Oh my so God. So people were just fucking going, like taking turns and honking at each other like fucking crazy people. I was like, oh my God. It was bad, man. Like, <clears throat> I was in that car for probably an hour and a half. I'm so sorry. I've survived. It's I okay. thought that you knew that the podcast was well, here. Well, because I remember, like, we were having a conversation, like, oh, we're going to do it here or at your house or something. Yeah. <laughs> hey, I got you that, by the way. What? That drink. Oh, thank you, man. Yes, you. Thank you very much. What is it? Uh, Coke. Okay, thank you. Yep. Perfect. How's that egg? You're good. Can I have some? Yeah. Thanks. Dude, that shit's hot. Is it? You want any more? No, you can have uh, it. Just don't burn your mouth. You are a psycho. That was psychotic what you just said. <laughs> That's really good. <laughs> it's the yolk I was worried about. I didn't want yolk on my pants. That shit's actually fire. That's, that's, be that's better than my eggs. That's way better. <laughs> I think scrambled just sucks. I think sunny side up is the best way to eat it, actually. Really? Why? I don't know. I feel like that shit's it's, for like... It's natural. Yeah, that's what. It is. Yeah, that's right. It's cracking pan. Let's sit there and touch this shit. <laughs> it's actually so fucking. It's like perfect cooked too. You know how I learned how to make sunny side up? Naruto. Naruto. Yep, Naruto. Oh my gosh. There's a there's a filler episode where Itachi teaches Sasuke how to make a over or a sunny side up egg. Yeah. It's a good ass episode. What? Why is that an episode? Oh, I don't know. It was good though. Hmm. God damn. You're a good cook. Thanks. Mm hmm. Oh. Well, guys, that was the episode. Thanks for coming in. <laughs> speaking of the uh, speaking of anime, you know, I actually started watching Death Note. <gasps> Finally. I did. Wait, how far are you? I am so so I cannot express how happy I am that I did not watch that show as a kid. Wait, why? Because if I did. I would have been so fucking insufferable, it would have been insane. <laughs> Why? Because it's so good. Isn't it and so I good? Would been, I would have been <laughs> so like, great. oh my god, this is awesome. Yep. This is the coolest show ever. These guys are so, These are, this is the coolest dude. Yep. I loved it, man. How far are you in? I am like where they first actually meet each other. The two, yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Okay, I just... There's going to be a scene in a car. Uh -huh. Let me know when you get to that scene. Okay. All right. That scene changed my life. Really? Oh, my God. It's so... You're in such a good Wait, part. Wait, is it the one with... He whispered with the... No. Oh, yeah. Okay, well, on it.
You remember that part or no? It's not on the car, is it? It is. It is. I don't want to I know what you're talking about. Yeah, I don't want to throw nothing. I don't want to throw nothing. Bro. Any potato chips been eaten? Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. That was so right, stupid. Yeah. I loved it. Oh, bro. I love that so much. Yeah. It, like, I, I was really, really surprised because, mm. like, I remember how cringe the fans of the anime were. Mm. And it's like, well, I know this show is bad. It's only losers well, watching. You know what sucks mm. is usually, like, the worse a fan base is, it means that the original better, media it's like actually Rick and Morty. is really good. Yeah, 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 exactly. It sucks. Wait, is Rick and Morty good? Yeah, it's, it was the beginning was. I, I remember watching Oh, I've never seen some I heard it's getting good again, but they have new writers. Yeah, it was just a Szechuan sauce incident, and I just did not want to fucking watch that show at all. I'll give oh, it a chance. yeah, about the McDonald's, like harassing yeah, the so workers and cringe. everything. Yeah. <clears throat> I don't know. Yeah, I, I watched it, man. It was so fucking good. It's it so was. Good. It was so. Treat. It gets even better. It gets I, even better. Yeah. You're so lucky. I wish I could watch that show for the first time. Because it came yep. out in 2006, right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That was so whenever I was in high. That would have been prime. Oh man, <laughs> I am so glad I didn't watch that. It would have changed him as a person. I would have been so <laughs> annoying. <laughs> Did you guys have kids at your school who had actual physical death notes? Oh yeah, yeah, sure. You yeah, were that kid. Yeah, I, I was him. Oh a, my god. I had the death note. Remember, I didn't tell you that story. Did you write people's names in it? You don't remember this? I thought I told you. Maybe you did. What was it? I wrote the kid's name in the death note the next day he was dead. <gasps> I forgot about that. Yeah. Try it again. Yeah. <laughs> no. But I do have another death note. I have one of my. Wait, how did he die? Oh man, he got shot up. What? Mm-hmm. He would get caught in the middle of a drug deal. Well, you can't win them all, right? Yeah, you can't win them all. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> It'd be like that. I did try immediately after. After he died, I was like, oh, fuck. <laughs> I'm him. <laughs> I wrote my history teacher's name and immediately after. He didn't die. Dude, that's, that's like attempted murder. <laughs> well, it's no, I don't think so. Like, I don't think that would hold up in the court of law, no, actually. No, it, it it's wouldn't, testing murder. No, it, it wouldn't hold up in the court of law, but technically, that's attempted murder, because you believed that he would die. Uh-oh. Well, you know. Well, it's no, not like... I don't know about no, that like, one, guys. But, like, uh-huh. technically... It, it's more like an experiment. Mm. Yeah, it's an experiment. You know what? I'll write somebody's names, uh, somebody in chat. Yo, chat, what's your name? Hold on, let me find the death note. We're going to see if this shit works right now. Yeah. What's your legal first and last? Yeah, name? legal first and last, guys. Yeah, I need a too. <laughs> Here we go. Oh yeah, he needs a picture too. Oh yeah, that's right. Okay. Post the Ember link. John Tectone? No, I don't think so, guys. <laughs> I don't think, I don't John think so. Tectone. <laughs> mm. John Tectone. Why does this sound so wrong? I know. <laughs> John Tectone. Because of Moon Moon. Yeah, John, John Souls. It's <laughs> such a good name. Hey, should we uh, should we show off the set? Oh yeah. Oh, uh, so mm-hmm. I didn't get to tell. I didn't get to brief Asman because mm-hmm. he didn't even know that we were filming here. He went to the wrong place. Isn't that a so, cool thing? So um, we've been given per- official permission to give the first ever tour of the OTK back rooms, our studio. We have a lot of stuff here. Uh, we're gonna break the immersion, show like what the set looks like. There's some other sets here too. Uh, this is also doubles as like an office, kind of. Well, we have an, another building too where the meetings are now. Cool. But shall we? I so guess we're just, we're just doing a, a immersion ruining for fun. Yeah. All right. Dude, they're gonna they're not gonna not they're not gonna like the lights. That's gonna make them angry. The lights. When we show them how the the windows work here. Oh. Yeah, they're not gonna like that, yeah. man. Wait, should we should we bring them in from where we normally walk in? So yeah. We can, like, show That's them a, the, yeah. The, yeah. 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 <laughs> Permission to swag out. <laughs> hey, Amy, let's throw to the uh, control ad first. Bro, oh, control. Um, first we have a um. We we have an ad. We we have an ad. We're gonna run an ad, and then then you're gonna and see we're gonna it. Have another ad after that, and yeah. then there's gonna be another ad. Mm-hmm. And then after that, we might do a, another ad. We're not sure yet. Mm-hmm. We'll, we'll play the ad now. Contact us. If- Listen up. We've recently had the chance to try out today's sponsor, Control, and let me tell you. We've been absolutely gorging ourselves on these protein cookies ever since. All right, one sec. As streamers, as gamers, we see eating as nothing more than an annoying chore, a time-consuming activity that we have to do to maintain this pathetic fleshy cage. All right, one sec. But with control, I can grab a protein cookie, 
grab a protein bar, or simply take 20 seconds to make one of their meal replacement shakes, and I stay full for hours. It's so convenient. It actually makes me angry. If I don't even have time to maintain small talk with Jay, how do you expect me to make it time to cook a meal like some sort of chef savant? I'm not a cooking prodigy. But even if I were, I wouldn't even need to use those bizarre skills. All right, one sec. Control products don't just taste great. They're high in protein and low in sugar. All right, one sec. When I'm busy crushing weights at an unspecified new gym owned by an unspecified friend, I need something that's gonna help me build up these guns. Yep, control! All right, one sec. Whether your goal is to get ripped or help you lose weight, control's a solid choice to help you on your journey. Get off your growing dependency on meal delivery apps and try it today. Click on our link in the description and try out their bundle builder for up to 20% off on top of our code that gets you 10% off. Wait, so were we all saying muted because Tectone was really loud or because the sound actually wasn't playing? Anyway, um, so normally this is where we come in to the studio. The door's back here. Yeah, so... Ta-da! <laughs> From behind the curtain. Um, oh my god, where do we even start? So this is a server. There's like a bunch of servers <laughs> oh yeah, and these shit are here. The OTK like, backpack servers. Think They're of it like a, it's like a LAN party for streamers or yeah, fucking computers much. or some shit. I don't uh -huh. know what the hell this is. And then we have our uh, is, uh, server monitor keyboard. Doesn't, shit. Yeah, there it is. It and then right these are there. boxes. There's a bunch of boxes. Uh, these are and our OTK boxes. Yeah, please what buy are, the merch. Oh, these, oh, these please, are buy, the please buy the merch so we can get rid of these. <laughs> and then we have over here. These are a bunch of things, and if you can see <laughs> yeah, inside of these, these are actually things that contain other things, like such as rope naturally like if we need to hang somebody yeah, we well like that's if, if somebody's stream numbers get too low we'll just go ahead and and take care of the problem <laughs> and <laughs> yeah well, no i mean Bro, wait what are these i don't know what uh, are these what is this this is a um these are this is where these look like like you know like at school in the library like the computer yeah. racks maybe it's that i don't know i don't know what these are but they're covered in dust and these, so apparently, I didn't know this, this is all new stuff from my P.O. box. What? I I don't even know, like, at a certain point, most of my house is going to be resources and things from my P.O. box. Like, yep, this is from my P.O. box. There's even more back there. Oh, my fucking God. <clears throat> Those open zone. I, I I don't I I I don't even know where okay. to begin. Never mind. I don't even know where to fucking begin. <laughs> it'll, it'll be okay, sir. Here's, here's a picture. Here's a, oh good. It's a oh, just what I fucking needed. Yep. Great, oh, another so goddamn. Oh wow, look at this. What is this? Is there like a, a tracker in this? Is it a yep. bomb? Yeah, like a I don't know. Right do we inside. have a Do we have a metal detector for this? <laughs> There's no way. Somebody literally just sent me a fucking dog. Oh what? good. Thank I, I guarantee you. there's cameras in there. Yeah, I hope so. I'll yep. put it in the bathroom then. There you go. So thoughtful. So we've got we've got chairs over here, and this is let's see what this what is. What is this? this? Where are these table and chairs from? Is this from a set? Um, this know. is from um, yeah. King Arthur. This is from King Luke Arthur's. Goblins. It's from King Arthur's Round Table. Yeah. Oh, okay. And uh, then these are the gamer subs cups that we have right here. And, Best RPG uh, Baldur's Gate 3! Wow. Whoa. Wow. That's amazing. And we have some... We have, that? We have no, more lanyards. Baldur's Gate 3. We probably have oh. more lanyards than we have viewers right now. Look at all these lanyards. This is incredible. Yeah, Look at lots this. Of merchant we have business cards? So those are Thomas's cards. Oh, those are Thomas's cards. Thomas's. Yeah. I'm, mm, I'm sorry, Thomas. Mm, he's a very mm. serious sorry. guy. Mm. What? Oh no! Yeah, Thomas is always trying just, to work in here while we're doing our bullshit. I feel kind yeah. of bad. Yeah, I've been I'm here sorry, for Thomas. almost every single episode. I'm it's sorry, crazy. man. He's always so just sorry. working, and we're like screaming over there. <clears throat> yeah. I'm sorry. <clears throat> Naturally. And so we had this idea that we were gonna do in the show whenever it first came out. We were thinking like, oh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna start. I hope this breaks. Um is we're gonna start here and we're gonna walk down like we're coming into like a basement. But we didn't do that because that was like something you did in a 90s sitcom and no, I don't even know what year it is. No, we forgot and then we never did it. Wow. 
we and were going to have every guest come down. We're like, oh my god, that'd be so yeah. cool that we just forgot and never did well, it. Well, then I think we had one guest that was really lazy, and we could tell that they didn't want to get up after they sat down, and we're like, this is just not going to happen. Wait, who was that? I don't know. It might have actually just been the Nanners episode, and it was oh, like, yeah. Yeah, what are we going to we we have somebody in like yeah. a... You know, a black robe carrying down a fucking TV. I don't know. Slap made it a point to make sure he walked down. I think Slap is the only guest to ever walk down. Ted and they they use the stairs. I was like, wait, we have those. I yeah, forgot. Yeah. Well, so we have over here. Well, we've got tons of decorations. Here. Um, I didn't even notice all these before. Yeah, what up, Jay? I'll give it a minute. So we've got um, schooled week two winner Jay Schlatt. This is a loser trophy. We probably shouldn't make these. These are participation trophies. Did they actually send these out? Is I this hope for, not. Is this for parasocial? Uh, yeah. Oh, it's got a uh, sad face on it. That way, you never think that you're a winner. And this is uh, OTK Best Content Organization. This is back whenever we were relevant two years ago and this is a Game Boy. Uh, Emmy, you might not know what this is. This is actually came out three thousand years ago. I've and never seen one of those yeah, life. yeah, that's that's a good thing because they were fucking annoying, and uh, I played Pokemon Blue on that, and oh yeah, we used to be partnered with Mountain Dew Game Fuel, and they made. What happened to that? I don't remember honestly, I really don't remember, but they made trading cards out of us, and nobody cared because Doc was one of the trading cards, and everybody wanted to get Doc. And nobody cared about any of us next to Doc. <laughs> and this, I guess, is new. Um, this is, I guess, a picture of pirate software. Yeah, I was right. It's pirate software. And Tecton said he and, thought I was going to say Pokemane. Oh. Well, you know, it's you know, it's either yeah. or, right? Okay. Could be one or the other. And this is. Uh, I broke that earlier. I'm sorry. Well, fuck him. Sorry. Oh, well, it's not. That, I mean, it's not my problem. It's his. Sorry. Oh, wait, and someone is, gave this us this at a... Was it Anime Expo? Uh, no, this was a person that sent that in to us. No. No, no, no. I got some, that shit in person. Yeah, someone... Wait, I think what? it was Anime Expo. Yeah. Wait, you no, that was, that, was, that was TwitchCon. Yeah, they gave us three of them. So TwitchCon, yeah. they gave one to me yes. in person, too. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah. So we got that. Hey, so why don't you, why don't you explain that right there? How'd that get here? How what? How'd that Brachydeos get there? That so, was to be yeah, so yeah, yeah. Brachydeos... Yeah. So Tectone like, Tectone wanted to give me this. Yep. Yeah. But I've fought this monster before, <laughs> and I don't even want this fucking thing in my house. <laughs> like, I'm not, as you can see, I'm not even touching the actual character. Just like whenever it took me 40 minutes to kill it. And so, uh... It's a good fight. Yeah, yeah and... It, anyway, so, um... Let's see, what else do we have? Oh, this is the another one of the gamer sucks thing. This is a, a slinky. Um, oh, tip star. Oh, that's clever. Look at that. Wait, do we have two OTK... Streamer I guess, yeah. But they they're for the same year. Don't get excited. Oh, oh wait, I think it's because she, like, sent replacements because the, the first ones were, like, messed up or something. You want I don't know. know. fucked up about this? Because I remember whenever this was a legit thing. Stop. Uh, no, you don't. The part in the phone. I don't remember. My mom had one of these. She had one of these whenever I was, like, four or five years old. And she replaced it with a 1996 or something like that computer. Yeah. And we still had this. Like, whenever I, I moved everything out of my old room in, like, 2010 and like 10 or something like that. Yeah, it, and, like, this is the one where the whole screen is only green. And, so, like, these fucking keyboards are massive. So who, who's, who's homeboy on the right of that? What? Who's homeboy on the right, Asmund? Right there, next to the computer. Who's, who's homeboy? Yeah, who's that? Ryu? That's right. Yeah, of course. He knows. Wait, oh, I know. Did you show him the tips jar? Yeah. I did show the tips jar. There wasn't that much money in it. No. It's a race. Yeah, it's OTK's net worth right now. And so, yeah, this is the this is where we sit down. And let's see, what else do we have? Oh, yeah. At the beginning, I played Imaru for rock, paper, scissors. Naturally, I won. And so I got this sword here, which is great. And can use that to cut steak or do pretty much anything else. Oops. I got a sword here, too, but it's, it's gone now. I think someone broke it. Uh, I broke it. I remember, I think somebody thought that it was actually trash because it was so small. Yeah, well, I liked room. I liked messing with it every episode. Yeah, I broke and it. Now it's gone. Unfortunately, yeah, that's why I have this one. You know, nobody's throwing this one away. I've that's got the it. Cool one. Yeah, it is the cool one. And so I was so pissed that I lost that, by the way. Well, I mean, <laughs> yeah, I bet, the worst part about it, guys, is that she tried to cheat and she still lost. No, I didn't. 
Yeah, I think you did. I remember like you waited for a minute to, to do it. It took a while. You're and crazy. Yeah, I know. I was gonna start gaslighting you because I don't I don't remember what happened, so Well I disagree with you. It's okay. Hey, this is where I do all the ads. So yeah, this is where yeah, we over yeah, here, where um the ads. most of the Luke album set was um put in storage or disassembled, but we still have the bar for doing ads. We have um giant Armor gloves, microwave. For some reason, That's we have here. this fucking hammer. And I swear to God, this hammer is like 50 pounds. It says 55. I think it's 55. It's 55. This is crazy. Oh Dude, I God. came in here on Monday, and I recorded 15 ads with Finn. What? Yep, and they're all for our Patreon. Why would they put ads on Patreon? No, I made it. So, oh. full disclosure. Yo, check this shit out. Yeah, there you go. What is that? Go ahead, know. say what it is. No, don't tell her. Don't yeah. tell her. Is this from WoW? Maybe. Oh, wow. Good good pick. Okay, what do you think it's called? Well, how the fuck would I know what it is then? <clears throat> why, are you looking, why are you looking at me? He's asking the question. Why are you getting angry at me? I didn't even do anything. I'm angry at both of you. <laughs> for, for what did I do? But I can't look at you when I speak to you. You just yell at me. You never yell at this fucking guy. That's not true. Oh, okay. I don't... Do I actually yell? I don't feel like I... At me. You know what I mean? I hate dread. What, I, when? When I fucking broke your couch. That wasn't even my couch. Somebody's couch. Couch. You told me to do that. How can Why you break it? Can you still sit? Well, oh, 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 oh. Can you still sit on it? Hey, that's what I'm saying. Yes. Then it's not broken. Exactly. Dude, how is that? I got you a hate thread when you broke the couch. Because you told me to stand on it. Oh yeah, I did. Yep. Well, I didn't think it was gonna break. Neither, neither did I. <laughs> neither did I. <laughs> no, actually, actually, remember that time that um, what was I trying to? I was announcing something on so. Oh yeah, I remember that. <laughs> yeah, I remember that. <laughs> Yep. I just and you that and Makari were yelling at each other. I remember that. That was great. That was one of the best things. And that's Shadowmorn, by the way. Which is an axe. It drops from ICC after you get 50 Shadow Frost shards. And then you kill the Lich King. And then it evolves, right? Well, you actually don't have to kill the Lich King to get the, the axe. But whenever you do kill the Lich King, you get the box with all the stuff. Doesn't, yeah. doesn't it start off as a different axe and it upgrades into a different axe? Shadow's Edge. Shadow's Edge. Which is a 264 Edge. item level weapon. Yep. Oh, I remember that when orange, when you had orange item level, you were like fucking oh, yeah. OP. Oh, yeah. It was red too, huh? Gears for it. Yeah, There's gears actually for it. something very scary behind this door. So yep. I want to show yeah. them. Yeah. Come on. Come on. As you Careful. can see, as you can see, Careful. the scary thing is me. <laughs> no, the scary thing is you can, there's a window that you can see outside. Oh. Too scary. I've never, what can I see? I want to go see Jay. It's the Check only it. window that isn't covered Jay. in the whole I'll kill you. Really? Yeah. Oh, well, look at that. Thanks, Jay. <laughs> well, that, I'm sure that'll help some psycho video whatever this is. Yay! Um, and then over here, uh, I guess this is a ladder for some reason. And we have a lot of sandbags here. It keeps the set from falling over. I guess so. Mm -hmm. And then over this way, <laughs> We have, this is like, oh jeez. The how do we, school how do we set. Do this? Yeah. Um, so this used to be our old desk that we would use for meetings. And then for no apparent reason, we decided to get a worse one. And now we use that now instead. Yeah, I don't really know why that. So we used to have owner's meetings in here at this table. Yeah. And then wasn't the problem like, oh, we don't have enough space. Let's move somewhere else. And then we have a smaller table now. Well, we have a smaller table, but there's a lot of empty space. And like halfway through the meeting, someone just starts randomly walking around. And that's basically about it. And then this is the school set right here. Uh, this is where a lot of cheating has happened. And uh, I've actually never really looked at any of this. Yeah. Oh my God. I've only been over here like once and we come here every week. Yeah. Wow, soda really did look like an idiot, huh? Jeez. That's so rude. Well, I mean, I did too. What are you, what are you writing? <laughs> what is this for? <laughs> Sign, <laughs> pokey, go to Brazil, rhyme. I'm gonna leave this as a little note for when Miss ever checks that. Oh. Yeah. Price owns you. Yeah, oh, yeah. a little treat for him later. <laughs> Oh man. What else do we have? We've got merch racks, couch, equipment, bathrooms. Oh, we have, wait, the most important part. We have the fucking, the snacks and the coffee. 
which I come over here every Monday. It's always stocked. I don't know who stocks it. I think Sinek, maybe. I'm the guy who always makes the coffee. So. No, you weren't. I made my own coffee today. Oh, well. That's I, why it's messy. Oh, well. I usually make the coffee. I like making coffee. Something about it's nice. It's like a good, like, uh, methodical thing to do. Get me ready. Also, goddamn control. I love these. Well, you know what usually happens here? Oh, wait. What are these? Wait, who put these what? here? Pez. Oh, oh yeah, shit! Oh, these are so cute. I never so, well, I was gonna this. say what normally happens is, yeah, the snacks will get filled up with like you know like Doritos, Takis, all that stuff. But then eventually, all that's left is the healthy shit that no one wants to eat, like the peanuts and the Nutri-Grain, uh, pretzels, protein pastry, because we eat all the really unhealthy bad ones. So this is what's left. Yeah, if there's like, candy. yeah, the fruit roll-ups, those are going to be gone by next week for sure. Candy, gamer sups, mini fridge, all of our drinks. And then, yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. Then there's like some uh, office rooms too, off the side. But yeah, it's cozy. Wait, did we show them that the windows are fake? No, we haven't. I think that's like the... I don't one. think we should, be honest. That kind of, that kind of ruins the whole Wait, show. Well, I already did, I just said that they're fake. It's just joking. It's, they're not fake. It's <laughs> the, real. The real guys. They're real. Jake and Mom, let's just show them. Let's just fucking get it over with. All right. Take a look at it. Yeah. Uh, maybe you're on this way. Maybe it might be easier. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. Yeah. This is the best part of the set. Man, this so place nice. is all kinds of fucked up. This is dirty. Yeah. Oh, my. This is almost like my house. I could live here. Oh, why do we have construction mats? Maybe this for Yep, there it is. Guys, it's fake. No. Just like the moon landing, it's oh. fake. Yeah. No. I can't believe it. I'm sorry, guys. It's actually not in my basement. I don't have a basement. I wish I did. If I did, I'd live there. That's fucked up. Is that everything? I think that's about everything. So I mean, I'm trying to talk. think, like, what else do we need? I just want to talk. I got so much I need to talk about. All right. Yo, Asmund. We're also doing a, a Q and A. Woo! Emmy doesn't know uh, about Vosh. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> we get to tell you about all that, man. Okay. Well, I know oh, a, a little bit. He gave me like a a super. Wait, should we clean? Like. Uh. Why would you do that? Cause it's this is really bad. What do you mean? Why? <laughs> that thing's fun. What my pants on? No, it's not good. Uh, was your pan off? Yeah, it's off. All right, good, good, good. Cool. This is, like, really bad. <laughs> Chat, should we just leave it like this? You know what? Oh, wait. I don't think we've ever told them that one of the des design ideas we had for the set originally was every week we were going to bring fast food in uh, cups and stuff and then leave the cups and over time the trash would accumulate. See, like, this is how you know Emmy isn't a real degenerate because, like, she would know if you did that, there'd be so many roaches. No, that's what we, because, yeah, they told us that we, we weren't allowed to do that because there would be ants. Yeah, but, like, if you need, if you worry about ants all the time, you're going to spend your whole life worrying about ants. That's okay, true. well, that's, that was, like, yeah, so, that was, like, tips being, like, we don't want ants Well, in the you just get a, you, I, I, I dealt with ants real easy. You just get a vacuum cleaner, and that basically takes care of the situation. Okay, well. We weren't allowed by corporate to have ants in the studio. They shut us down. They said you have to keep the set clean, so mm. that's why it's very pristine. You think if we don't clean this right now, we're going to be forced to clean it afterwards? I hope so. I mean, realistically, like 80% of this just goes in the, in the trash. Like 80% the, the of this and the is Miskiff's fault. <laughs> 20% okay. Emmy, 20% Tacto, and 80% Moose. <laughs> oh, man. So how was it getting your first hate thread in years, Emmy? Um, it was, I kind of liked it. I don't know. What were they saying? What were the worst things they were saying? Well, I mean, first of all, it's like, I really have, like, no excuse for that. I was, I was like, genuinely embarrassed. I was like, well. So I wasn't, like, upset. What did you like, do? Wait, you didn't see? No, I don't Oh my god. Shit. So I, I parked at the gym. Yeah. And my car was like out of the out of the um parking spot. Oh, that was real? Yeah. I thought that was just like some random idiot yeah, that I had really the same type of car know. that you did. 
Yeah, and that actually, you actually comment, did that yourself. Yeah, in the comments, that's I saw crazy. Was like, Good job. Someone was like, "How does this even happen?" And yeah. then the, the reply was like, "Narcissism." And I was like, "Bro, imagine fucking up something so bad that people just think you're really fully." No, no, no. I, I thought it was so bad. I legitimately thought whenever I saw the picture because somebody posted it as a joke. Jeff, I said Jeff posted it as a joke. I thought, oh, that's funny because Jeff went and got some some <laughs> dumbass that had the same car as Emmy. To just go and like you know just like some dumbass that parked the wrong yeah, way. I really don't. Oh know, my I really god! Don't know how how that many happened. people said that's sorry. crazy? I'm sorry, everyone had to see that. How many people said Asian female driving? Probably a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Asian female streamer Corvette yeah. driver. Yeah, Were you streaming at the same driver. time? Yeah. yeah. Were you wearing a seatbelt? Yeah, of course. Oh, well, I mean, it could well, be I, worse. I, you have to because I want, like, I don't think your car does this, but mine will, like, beep at you, like, like a bomb. If you don't wear a seatbelt long enough, the, the beep will go <laughs> out. And some things just solve themselves, if you know what I mean. Okay, well. Like, if you get in a wreck without a seatbelt, you're dead, and then you don't have any more problems. So, you were talking a little, actually, you know what? <laughs> How many of you guys saw the Elden Ring DLC? I haven't watched the trailer yet. I've been what waiting. do you mean? I've been waiting yeah. because what are you I waiting was gonna for? Well, I was going to watch it today, but then I realized we were doing this. Wait, we can watch it right now. We could. Do you want to watch it right yes. now? Yes. Okay. Wait, let's can we do put it. it up? Bro, wait. Uh, is it? Uh, but you don't have Check audio up. though. Really? Yeah, you don't have audio. I can watch it on my phone or something. Oh wow, that's super exciting. How, how climactic? <laughs> You should wait. You should wait. It's a big moment. It's a big moment. And it looks so What's fucking good. React? Well, you, know like, the, you know the best part of this? I could steal Synax laptop. There's confirmed to be uh, poison swamps. Yeah. <gasps> no. They've confirmed yeah. a poison Why? swamp. Poison swamps. Because the creators of Elden Ring fucking hate you. They don't like you. And there's uh, 10 plus new bosses. You know, Miyazaki, I think that he went on record saying something like he wanted poison swamps in the game. <laughs> Because it gave people the same feeling as male pattern baldness. Stop. Where it was like you would get out of it, but then you had to go back in and you had to acknowledge it. And it was going to really happen. Say that? It no really was some kind of stupid shit like that. I'm not even kidding. Like he was talking about like Dark Souls or something. And people brought that up. He never said that. I don't know. Where's the fucking, where's, I don't know, where's my phone? He probably said that. He probably, probably said it. I yeah. I think he said that. Well, I don't know. I don't speak Japanese, so. 10 plus new bosses. Apparently, it's just as. Ten? Yes. Apparently, there's just Ten as. Plus. Yes. Oh Apparently, there's, it's just as big oh as the base God. game. Wait, I was thinking it was going to be. Nobody what? said it's as big as. He no, said you were going to take no, it. I thought it was going to be no. small. Like what is two, three no, bosses. that's not what he said. Okay, what did he, he say? Said that. He said that it is a little bit. He said it's larger than Limgrave. Which is the first main big zone? Oh my god! That's a big one, isn't it? And so it's that's that's the size of the of the place. It's gonna have new lore, eight new types of weapons. It's got melee combat weapons, which is fucking crazy, like a kick. And it's not bigger than the whole game. I thought it was supposed to take as long to beat the DLC as There's it did no take the base game. I mean, it's going to take no some way. people that long. It's okay. Suck, but There's no way if it's 10, 10 plus. Listen, man, I'm just telling you what Reddit said. Okay, don't, hey, it's not my fault. I'm just letting you know what I saw on Reddit. <sighs> what the fuck they're talking about? It depends on who it is that's doing the fights. That but makes sense. There's like a hippo, and you have to kill him. And there's like apparently, you know, Grunbeld from Berserk. Well, they put him in the game, and he's got snakes and shit, and we got to kill him. Is that, so, so is that is that Mikola? No, it's not. Uh, so why did they say Mikola in the trailer? Because it's like his dream or something like that. Okay, so we don't think the mesmer is related to that. I think that he's a, a, a I think he's a relative of Mikola. He's like a brother that was removed from the history in the same way that the nameless king was in Isn't Dark Mikola Souls Three. Fucking dead. Yeah, he is. Nope, what's going to happen is we're going to kill the Mesmer, and then he's going to turn to the Mikola. We're going to awaken from the dream, and the Mikola's there. That's the finale of a set of Urtrick. That's or, what could happen. I read yeah, it, I, I read it. I don't know. I, I, I'm excited, though. I really am. I'm going to play through Elden Ring again. I'm going to do it with a mod or, like, a, um, a randomizer again. The thing is that the problem with me playing Elden Ring is that it's that I'm so good at it that it's not fun to watch. So I saw some guy in chat type, Dicto knows the ending to One Piece. I trust this guy. You oh, think that's what's going to happen? Yeah, I've already, I've, already, I've, already, I've already told you. Yeah? Wait, did I not tell you this? 
Oh no, yeah, you told me that about seven times. Yeah, the ending of One Piece? Yeah. Yep. I know. I haven't even seen the show and I know how it ends. Yeah. It's not crazy. So you don't gotta watch it. They're making a new anime for One Piece hey, too. Sorry. Just so you know, we're gonna switch to these cameras for the podcast. I didn't oh. know if you guys were going into it or um, oh. why mean, don't I, we do that? Yes, yeah, because we're probably gonna be sitting here. Why don't we just do that? Yeah, yeah we, let's we get swap to use over. the good mics. One more ad, so call today. Oh, so we're another gonna, ad. Oh, I, I was gonna sell out for you, but oh, yeah, go, go there's. Ahead, go ahead, please. And now a word from our sponsors. Sure has been raining a lot recently, but not all of us want to look like some idiot with an umbrella. Luckily, Vessi provides a great way to avoid getting drenched. With 100% waterproof shoes, clothing, and other accessories, Vessi can help you enjoy those pesky rainy days. But don't just take my word for it. Luckily, I have Asmongold here to demonstrate the power of Vessi's advanced Dymatex technology. Thanks for that, Asmin. As you can see, even rainstorms and puddles of water won't ruin your day with the Soho sneakers. You can also check out the Ulta High Tops if you're looking for something warmer this winter. Additionally, we tried out the Overcast Jacket as well as the new Stormburst sneakers. And now, we've never been more prepared for the rain. I'd say anyone could pull off this look, even Finn with his silly little umbrella. Learn how to enjoy the rainy weather this winter with Vessi. You can visit Vessi.com slash steak eggs to grab your own waterproof gear today. That's V-E-S-S-I dot com slash steak eggs. Link is in the description and thanks Vessi for sponsoring our podcast. Are we live? Oh, we're back. Isn't that obvious that I read off a prompter for those? Mm. Finn has like the iPad and it scrolls through the text for us to read when we do those. I think the ads are the best part of steak and eggs every week. I go through them every single time. They're so fucking good, man. Finn I've does an never amazing even job. Seen one. They're really good, man. I've never seen any. Yeah, Finn, Finn does an mics? amazing job. Wait, what mic's not on? Mm. Hold on. We'll figure it out. Ha! Okay. Mm. Emmy mic bad. Do they? They might just boost my audio in post-production normally. <laughs> I actually don't know. Yo, mic check. If not, they can just add a, a gain filter to OBS or whatever. Yeah. Okay. Oh, apparently I'm boosted now. Okay, are you chilling? Like in like league. Alien. Yeah, like in league. Oh, bro, I got punished today on league, man. I'm, I'm, oh, this is going to sound like such a flex, but it's not. So I'm max ranking. Well, let's let them fix the mics first so they don't have to listen to us talk about League with the mics also fucked. Oh, maybe okay. That's the, maybe that's good that we get it out of the way now. Oh, they said fixed. All right, yeah. We're I'm seeing right. all mic bad. All, are all mics good now? I'm saying fixed. Okay. Techno's mic is good? Okay, great. Fixed techies, not others. <clears throat> all right, well, then since y'all can't talk, great. Uh, wait, can I not? Are we still tech on loud? Okay, all right. No, I'm sure Y'all hear me? They're working on it. I mean, this is probably the best way. To, why don't we just keep it like this for the next hour? No, <laughs> don't we tech on work? Is a tech tone show? <laughs> it's his dream. <laughs> Asmon's good. Emmy's mic is bad. Hello. Ooh. Hello. Hello. It says I'm ten times quieter. That must be accurate, then. <laughs> no, it's not. Okay, I'm going to trust that we're all good. There's no way I'll... The... They say my mic seems off. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I think we'll be <laughs> good. I don't think they'll type way too dank the moment I start talking. Uh, so I got... I'm, I'm max rank in TFT. And so I can't play with my friends anymore. It won't let me queue. So now I go to the gym by myself. I used to have all these friends, but I got too good too quick. Wow, suffering from success. Yeah, it's a shame, really. Am I still too quiet? Oh yeah, by the way, <laughs> so you can hear Emmy with that. By the way, um, we're actually doing a Q and A. So if you do has hashtag ask with your question, uh, Jay will pick his favorite questions to pull up that we can then um we can then yap from. So to translate that, so I say ask. <laughs> Hashtag ass. <laughs> yeah, tag me on Twitter. <laughs> Oops. So I want to tell you a story about why I'm glad to be white today. No, let's not do that. No, it's a good story. It's a good story. It's oh a good story. Oh my god, dude. See, this is why I, when I said earlier, we can't edit it if it's a live episode. No, it's good. It'll be good. Let me tell you what happened. 
So, okay. oh, uh, Mr. Beast dropped new chocolate bars at Walmart. Did you get those? Did I get the new oh, chocolate you, you bars? Oh, they from were Mr. handing those out of the streamer awards. Yep, apparently they're insane, right? So obviously, right? I want to go get the new Mr. Beast chocolate bars. We, I, I didn't feel like driving. I had long stream. I was stressed out. Got my home when it drives. Name's Laro. So we go to Walmart to get these Mr. Beast chocolate bars. Forty-five seconds after we left the house, okay, we get pulled over mm-hmm. immediately. Okay, officer pulls us over. Tells us apparently, this is news to me. Apparently, you need two license plates. That is not true. No, you don't. Okay. We need two license plates. No, you don't. Apparently, you need one in the front, one in the back in Texas. They're saying you're, you're too loud now. That's just no, that's just normally how I talk. It's fine. <laughs> now you're getting the proper experience. Yeah. Okay. Well, in Texas, apparently you do. That's what this officer said. Okay. So my buddy, he's driving, and when we got in the car, he said. Hey, by the way, you ever see my wallet? I haven't seen it around in a little bit. And I said, no, I haven't seen your wallet. The moment he pulls, pulls the window down, says, license registration, I realize, oh, wait a minute. Oh, shit, was he in his pocket? No, he didn't have it. Oh. So he told the officer, I don't have my license. Yeah? Yep. Okay. So then he asked for insurance. Did you have insurance? <laughs> no. no, I did not. Oh, wait, wait, first question. Wait, wait, wait. From I'm going to tell my story. Door, oh, I, I, I thought you were done. Go no, on. we're not done. We're not done. We're not done. We're not done. Oh, God. Okay. okay. So he asked for insurance, and I realized, oh, no, this isn't good. So the moment my buddy didn't have a license, officer said, get out of the vehicle, son. He gets out of the vehicle. I pull up my phone so quick, pull up Geico, reinsure my, re-insure my vehicle in like four minutes flat. Okay, so that way when he comes back to ask for my insurance, I'll be good to go. Okay, he comes around to my side, ask, ask for my driver's license because he didn't have his. This is okay. Are we, are we in trouble? Are we, are we all good? Okay. <laughs> yeah. All right, okay. He asked for my license. I give him my license. He says, son, wait, we need to restart? Okay, after the story, after the story, after the story. Okay, so I pull up my... Why uh, restart so you can tell it again? <laughs> I want to restart it, dude. It's fine. They can do a jump cut. Okay. So I pull out my driver's license and I give it to him. And he says, son, are you aware of what state you live in? And I say, yeah, I live in Texas. And he says, well, then why do you have a Florida's driver's license? And I say, why is that a problem? He says, you've been living here for longer than 90 days. I say, I've been living here for two years. He says, you got, you're supposed to change your license 90 days after coming to a new state. Wait, this is crazy because... I also got pulled over a while ago, and I still yep. had my Kansas license, and I didn't have it with me. He had to look it up, yep. but I had, like, my passport lease, and he was like, it's fine. I just don't want to see you again. But you had to go through <laughs> oh all that shit. Oh, my God. Okay, so now, do you guys know what I carry I in my car? I a different experience. I did the same shit. So, in my car, I'm not sure if you guys know this, I always have my katana. I carry my katana in my car at all times. That's a good idea. I have an axe. Yep. And Why? so Why? Oh, I have a stun gun in my car. Exactly. We're getting mm-hmm. self-defense, right? So my car's uninsured. We both have licenses. The license that I do have, right, is from Florida. I'm carrying a katana in my fucking car, and my vehicle was uninsured. And he just asked me, son, why did you not get a new license? And I looked at him, and I was in streamer mode a little bit because I've talked my way out of a lot of tickets. A lot of tickets. Okay, for no fucking reason, mind you. Okay, I got pulled over because I didn't signal long enough when I was in a right turn only lane. Uh huh. So because okay, so you can't. So for me, I signal right, I turn right. When I'm almost done with the turn signal, I turn it off. But apparently, if you don't have it on from the start to the finish, it doesn't count that it's long enough. Regardless, that was bullshit. He says, son, why do you not have your license updated? And I just said, officer, do you want me to be a hundred percent with you? And he said, yes. And I said, because I'm a lazy fat fuck and I don't want to go to the DMV. He probably said that was totally okay, right? Yep. I do that all the time. Yep. Yeah, I tell them, I, they said, why? Wait, so, what do you mean all the time? How often do you get pulled over? Well, I, have a, I have a game of hide and seek that I've been playing with the Austin Police Department. <laughs> and it goes back and forth yep. every about couple of years or so. And uh, whenever they catch me, they're like, we got you again. And I'm like, you got me again. <laughs> And they're like, why didn't you do it? I said, well, you know how it is. I just didn't do shit. And they're like, yeah, you know how it is. That's fine. And they're like, all right, we'll see you later. 
<laughs> just fix it. Dude, I said, okay. Dude, you just keep it. You keep it a buck with the police, and they they actually have a lot of respect for that. So yeah. Recap. Recap. Told the officer I was too lazy to do it. Didn't have proper license. Homie didn't have a license. Had a katana in my car. Vehicle was uninsured. Don't have the proper driver's license. How much do you think the ticket fine was? Driver, well, how much? Let you go. No. How, how much? How much do you think it cost? Actually. Uh. Well, okay, he, give me the. Give me the. The things. Again. Uninsured. No license. Okay. My license was in the wrong state. Okay. Uh. No proper driver's license. Two hundred eighty-five dollars. Zero dollars. He let me off with a warning. Oh well, yeah. I mean, sure. But like, yep. I mean, I thought if you actually got charged. Yep. Okay, <sighs> man. But we do want to say also, there's some people that have come in uh, a little bit late. Uh, welcome to the show. Welcome to Steak and Eggs. Steak and Eggs. This why? is our one year anniversary. Mm-hmm. I don't know what episode number this is. It's episode forty five. Well, so we missed nine episodes. So um, it's forty six. Forty six. Okay, so we missed f- eight episodes. Because mm-hmm. there's 50, you know, into 50. Yeah. yeah. And uh, and so, yeah, anyway, guys, if you're, you know, confused on Spotify, you're listening, we'll be answering some questions from chat, etc. So just keep that in mind. That's what's going on. Hopefully the audio is better. Everything is fixed. And so, yeah, no, I, I had the same thing happen. I got pulled over one time and I didn't have insurance. And I didn't have a registration. I didn't have inspection. Holy fuck. And the cop is like, well, do you have a license? And I said, (laughs) I was like, yep, I do. He goes, wow. And I'm like, yep, that's right. He's like, well. And I'm like, he's like, oh, you're not supposed to drive. I said, well, then can you drive me to school? (laughs) Wait, how old were you? I was 19. Oh. I was driving to college. I thought this happened like recently. I was like, there's no way he let you go when you're like in your 30s. Yeah, I was like 19. Why do you got to remind him? Well, now it's like. Uh, uh, I'm sorry. I mean, it's hard to to forget. What's wrong with being in your 30s? Okay, you're almost 30. Kind of. Four years. How's that feel? Basically 30. It's fine. Okay. I mean, most most of my friends are 30. So. Okay. All right. Yeah, we'll see how it feels when you're 34. <laughs> yeah, I know. That sucks, right? <laughs> no, it's actually awesome. Yeah. Because now I don't worry about it anymore. Yeah, it's true. Actually, it's a good point. Yeah, it's good as fuck. I've I've not worried about it a single fucking time. Really? Yeah. I was the same way. But I'm yeah, just, I'm just tired of hearing people like being 30 and like complaining about being 30. I'm like, holy fuck, it can't be that bad. You'll see. Like, is it really that bad? Well, I think like it's awesome, all actually. my friends, like there's a yeah, there's a lot of friends I grew up with in high school. And like middle school, they used to make fun of me for being skinny. Mm-hmm. And now I'm still skinny and they're fat. And so that's what happens whenever you get to be like 30 is that you start getting fat. And so I got a bunch of friends and you look at them and they're fat now. And I'm not fat, so it's fine. But it's kind of like they're 30 and I'm not, I guess. I mean, is, is, is it, being 30 and fat like that bad? Yeah, it's pretty bad. Why are you bad. looking at me, bro? Why the fuck did because you it, immediately because, because look at me? Because it was a question. Oh, okay. I, you you know, I'm asking up. a question. So but why I'm would he know? For... Why would he know the answer? Yeah. Why would I know? And I was one of them. Know? Yeah. Well, because like that's kind of fucked I don't up, know, right? Because yeah. you like just you know, given 30, the situ- so your answer is fresher, I guess. Cool. Given the situation. Hey, I'm gonna keep it 100. percent I think the stream might be effed. No. Is it really? Listen. Yeah. They said small f. They're just being. They're just being chat. They're just having a good time. You know, that's how they have fun. Oh, okay. Cool. All right. I did have a phase for like one or two months where I was like, I want to get fat. Like, I just want to know what it would be like. But I, I, You're tr- I there. couldn't. Thank you, man. <laughs> yeah, I got you. Man. I'm getting there. <laughs> yeah. I tried, but it just didn't work out. Yeah. How uh, fat have you been? What's the, fat, fattest the fattest you've been? The fattest I've been. Um, I don't know if I should answer this question. The most. Three hundred and eighty pounds, guys. Yeah, Three hundred and eighty <laughs> pounds. I want to read the uh, the question from chat so that Go way they ahead. know what's going yeah. on. Dorothea Dragon Song says, "All three, will you guys be watching the new Avatar series on Netflix?" I'm gonna watch the whole thing. I am also going to be watching the whole thing. You game. have to, right? I'm gonna watch it day. I think it's like think even it's, if it's bad, you got, you gotta watch it. Yep. Uh, there's absolutely no way in fuck that it'll be good. Is it actually actually a thing? What's happening? I don't know. It's been going on for like five minutes. 
Hmm. We can pause for a bit, I guess. Sure. Yo, Jacob, what's going on? Jacob F2. Cool. Apparently it's a Twitch issue. Hmm. God, I haven't effed in like months, so even seeing that shit again stresses me the fuck out, bro. That's the reason why I stopped IRL streaming. I there, there's there is nothing worse than trying to stream and it just breaking fucking nonstop. Yeah, backpacks are a pain to use. I mean, I'll be real. It looks good as fuck to me. Damn, this shit actually looks really good. What does? The stream. Your stream looks good. It's nice cameras. Yeah. Yeah, I, don't, I think it's a, a Twitch issue because our internet and OBS is fine. Okay. And what's weird is it looks perfectly normal to me. Yeah, let's, I mean, let's just go because we have the recording. So it's okay, cool. Good. Yeah, fuck it. Hi, Jacob. I'm trying to figure it out. It, no frames dropped in OBS and the internet's fine, so. All right. It's, it's either Twitch or one of our computers, but. Shit, right. maybe, maybe just, they're just lying. And they can see you, it's just freezing. Oh, uh, okay. That's what I would do. I go on the streamer's chats all the time and just start spamming up just to stress them the fuck out. Is that fucked up? <laughs> yeah, a little bit. <laughs> okay. I had a face on Twitch where I used to get my entire chat to go to random VTubers chat and start typing F. Oh, uh, it's such a good reaction. We were talking too. about... All of Twitch streams are lagging. Is this... Oh, okay, well... They specifically did this when we were going live. They tried to mm -hmm. shut me down. They saw I came on the camera. They said, get him the fuck out of here. Oh, apparently it hard f Uh. Well, hopefully it'll be fixed after this. Yeah, apparently it's all Twitch streams. I mean, I'm checking. I'm getting the vibe. It ain't all Twitch streams, is what I'm thinking. Saying back. Fix now? All right, let's just keep going. Cool. It is what it is. These things happen. Tectone, this is your fault. I uh, know it is. Please don't encourage chat. <laughs> wait, uh, no. Yeah. <laughs> wait, I, I guess some people would take it that seriously. Oh, yes, huh? they would. It's a joke, guys. He didn't do anything. No, trust me, dude. You say anything and say it's Tectone, so will be like, yeah, you know what? They're right. This guy should get the fuck out of here. Uh, by the way, yeah, the La Avatar Last Airbender, I'll be watching all of it, and I will not enjoy a single second of it. I feel like, well, is it that bad? Because... People yes. thought that One Piece was going to be bad. The live um, action one, it was actually pretty good, I thought. Okay, so the One Piece live action was good, but it wasn't as good as the anime, but it was good as a standalone. The Yu Yu Hakusho show was fantastic. I think the Yu Yu Hakusho show, I, I, I enjoyed it We personally. watched that at your house, right? Yep. Yeah, so that oh, was Oh, I forgot about that. Yeah. yeah, it was fun. Yeah, that was okay. It was fun. Yeah. It wasn't good. I mean, I don't know if it was. I mean, was it really good, though? I mean, like... Have you seen the actual anime? No. I haven't. Wait, but then why do people say that the Avatar one's going to be so bad? Because if the other child actor. Good? No, no, that's not why. Uh, they had a lot of like they changed a lot of things in the in the game or not like fucking what I'm just in the show. Uh huh. Yeah. Um. In the show, they changed a lot of things in the show because of like there was like some guy that was sexist and they took the plot point out and it was like trying to make it adapt it for like you know quote oh. modern audiences. That kind of uh, stuff. Yeah, 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 that kind of shit. So things that I farm like eight videos about it for. Wait, so but, is it kind of like the, the, the voice acting propaganda? Yeah, Genesis? yeah. Except the thing is, I never really, I never watched Avatar. I what never the did. fuck? Yeah, How? well, when did it come out? Oh, forever ago, man. Around 2000, I want to say like 2010. I'll Google it because if I say anything that's slightly wrong, they'll call me a fucking liar. I think it was before that. When did it come out? I'm going to guess 2009. 2005. Apparently. 2005. I mean, at, at that point, like the the only anime I watched back then was like Full Metal Alchemist, Ghost in the Shell. Like those are the main two I watched a lot. Maybe one more other. I'm trying to think else besides that. Because I didn't really get that much into it, but I did go to the anime club in high school. Do you like Full Metal Alchemist? It was like I grew up with it, right? I mean, like I really liked it a lot. Yeah, I thought it was great. Why? I just liked it. What I thought about it was I liked it too. Yeah. 
Yeah, I want. I don't remember why. I know food. what you're trying to get at. You're no, saying that it's not as good as people No, because every time someone says that it. they like formal, she's like, it's not that good. It's nostalgia yeah. goggles. No, I mean, it and, is good. Um, I don't know if everybody says that. I think it's the number one rated anime of all time on my anime list. I didn't say everyone said that. I said whenever someone says that. Well, I don't think it's really. I mean, I don't know if it was really good or not. Right. I mean, if I went back and I watched it again, what would I think? I don't know. But so I never watched it until 2022. Yeah. And I think it was a fine show. I always thought it was a kid's show. No, I don't think so, man. That's what I thought back then. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Kids in that show, they get turned to dogs. Nice. Yep. Yep. Uh, we should probably do more questions. So we have a question. I've recently been in the business and Tecton, you've been in the business as well of preserving managed <laughs> democracy. That's right. Yep, that's yeah. right. And Emru that's has a Oofy. Held yeah. divers two thoughts. That's right. Yeah, that's I haven't right. played it. I was, I was gonna play it, it two days ago with you and Nick, but that's right. I, I went offline because I was coughing too much. So that like so do you have COVID good. or like are you gonna die? No, like, I don't what's... have COVID. I I got a test. I have a throat infection. Why? I had a sinus infection and then it like dribbled into my throat or something. Just some stop shit. it. I tried, dude. I'm, yeah. not, I'm literally going to die soon, so you should stop well, being mean to me. You know, it's okay. Guys, just come watch me whenever she's gone, okay? But yeah, do you think, Hell Divers. <laughs> do you think an Emmy viewer would watch you? Absolutely not. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's Absolutely like, not. It's like when I get raided by a VTuber, and I'm like, what yeah. the fuck do you think they're going to do? Shy Lily will raid me sometimes, and I'm like, oh yeah, they really appreciate that. Yep. <laughs> Uh -huh. That is exactly what I wanted. When Lily raids me, they stay like the whole time. I, I wonder, wonder what the is. difference is. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, what's yeah. the difference, guys? I don't know. I mean, I'm just saying, like, you do need to play Helldivers too, though. It's really good. Um, How much have you played? It's, it's a. It, it is a co-op game, though. Like for me, I played it solo. I didn't have a lot of fun. But oh. all the all the co-op stuff I've seen has been really, really good. It's it's really fucking good. Uh, I think the game will be as fun as the people you play it with. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and I do think you have to play like a dumbass to really enjoy the game. Like real war. What game do you consider way ahead of its time? Preferably one you think isn't a popular choice. Well, I mean, let's be honest. Like what we spent the last popular? year talking about how AI was going to completely change the world. Yeah. And Kojima made a game about that in 2000 and like what, two with Metal Gear Solid 2. I'd say that one was really ahead of its time. That was crazy. Game that was ahead of its time that's not a popular choice. That's really hard. Is Metal Gear Solid a 2 a question. popular choice? Because I can come up with I another mean, one if people want. Oh, yeah, then yeah, I'll, 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 I'm also going to choose... This oh. is, this is kind of off topic, but did you guys see that Riot finally announced their fighting game? It's got some stupid name. Yeah, it's, it's, it's like 2X It's like KO. NSFW or yeah, something? But oh. I was thinking about it and like... I feel like it sucks for game devs because everyone's like, oh, like we're tired of all the same games, everything's the same. But then when they innovate, and like, but the thing is, like, I kind of agree that like a 2v2 fighting game doesn't really appeal to me. But it's, it's like when they try to innovate, it's like people are like, oh, this is too much shit, I don't like this. But then if they do the same format as everything else, it's like boring, you know? So I, just, I don't know. You can't listen to the pussies out there that love to cry. It's the same people that said Elden Ring was too easy. Gamers don't know what they want. Yeah, gamers don't know what they want, bro. They don't shit. So Elden Ring was like, hard as fuck. Elden Ring was hard? Yeah. Damn, I'm sorry to hear Wait, that. people said it was too bro, hard? Bro, you level up to level 300 and then you unga bunga it. I didn't need to do 300. Oh, what level were you? I remember whenever I went and I did my randomizer run recently, I just let chat decide how I kill the boss because to me it didn't matter. No, your original, so your original run. Um... And how many potions did you have? How many, and how many pluses were those potions at? Uh, probably a lot, man. <laughs> okay, like, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. You know? yeah, I know. I know. I play. I know. I'm. I, like, I'm good at you know setting myself. up I to never succeed. grinded a single time. Neither did I. Why would it's I grind? Right. We'll see. Why would I grind? There's no reason to grind. Okay. Am I only person? Like I don't care if someone's over or under leveled. It's like okay. Like, yeah, I do. It's like who fucking cares? <laughs> I care. Well, I want to see. The thing <laughs> is that. I remember whenever Emeru was fighting Melania, and yeah. I was really worried that she was going to kill Melania yeah, before I did. He me on Discord. He was like, I was scared you were going to beat her on 50 tries. Because like, I had one yeah. that was like, kind of close, and he was like, I was scared. Yeah. <laughs> and then that, that did, guys, let me tell you something. That didn't happen. Uh, it took way longer. And but so, I still beat it in like okay time. Well, people were saying it was going to take me multiple streams. Yeah. And what weapon did you use? Bloodhound Fang. 
That's a fun fucking weapon. Yeah. That's a really good one. Chat was telling me that shit was OP. It did not feel that OP. It's I felt like it was sure. a fine weapon. It's a very good gap My closer. My chat calls it the cuck sword because E Rob also used it. No oh, that makes sense. It. Yeah. Oh, yes. damn. <laughs> cuck sword. <laughs> That's so funny. I like having chat here for this. Can we just do every episode live? So, what's annoying about each of your co-hosts? Well, I can answer for myself. It's probably because I was almost an hour late. Nah, well, I feel but like... it's not annoying because we, like, kind of expect it. Yeah. <laughs> Why is that funny? The <laughs> best part is the production thinks that part's really funny. Yeah, production just laughs. I wonder camera. why. <laughs> I wasn't you... making a joke. Am I crazy? Do I just not notice it? I don't notice when y'all are late, ever. Well, another thing is, like... Almost every streamer is late, so like it's not something like exclusive. Yeah, I will say I am impeccably on time, pretty consistently for everything I do. But I just go on my phone. I don't give a fuck. It's not really a big deal, in my opinion. Take the time you need, man. Besides, the times that you're late are like catastrophic things. Like, oh yeah, my car blew up. Remember whenever my car died and I had to walk here? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Straight up, who Job gives a fuck, over. man? Yeah. There's something annoying about techie. Yeah, you have to think hard on that one, huh? You got to think real so hard. So sometimes whenever a tech tone is saying something that he obviously shouldn't, and then you try to interrupt him to stop him from he saying it, keeps he'll going. be like, wait a minute, hold up. I was about to tell the story <laughs> about why I don't like, uh, you, you know, like animals or a certain kind of people. Yeah. <laughs> this is bad. about why I think women have smaller brains. <laughs> so and basically. Like, yeah, well, what about, no, wait, I wasn't done talking. <laughs> yeah. See, this is what I was talking about. Is they, they can't even wait their turn. Uh, okay, it's my turn. What's annoying about me? No, you gotta, no, you gotta... What's annoying about Emeru? Oh, let me think. Give me a minute. Mm. I'm scared right so now. So before, it was annoying as fuck how you would never talk. It's hard. Right? But then you had a realization on another podcast where you said... Oh, y'all both just say dumb shit. I should do that, too. And then you were yeah. good for well, a couple... I mean, a, a lot of people know that, like, when I first came to Austin, and, like, before that, I never really, like, collabed with other people. Yep. I... It's like people say, like, I don't talk, like, in this type of context. Mm. Literally, when I came here, I wouldn't talk. I had, like, extreme social anxiety disorder. And it's gotten way better, but there's still times where I just, like... But I know it's bad because, like, I want to, like, be involved in the podcast. But sometimes I'm just like, you know, I'll just, you know, say if I have something to say. I'll just, you know. No, I think, I think after episode 15 or so, I think you, I think you've been doing a great job. So I don't think, it, that's what used to annoy me. But now I don't give a fuck. You're killing it. But what do you do that annoys me now? now actually, you interrupt me like crazy. <laughs> no, I do not. <laughs> yeah, you do. When? All the time, man. I'm always cutting myself off because you just interrupt way too damn much. Because okay. now you talk too damn much, to be honest. I'm you go sorry, back to how you man. used to be. My opinion. I'm sorry. That's all right. It annoys me that you don't get mad whenever you lose a lot in a game because it makes me <laughs> feel stupid because I do. <laughs> and so, like, I can't see, like, if I die four times on a boss, I'm not smiling anymore. This isn't fun. The fun is over. But, like, yeah, there was... You remember the Jump King? Remember what happened with that? That was fun, wasn't it? You no, liked that, that game? that game actually, like, bothered me on, like, a deep core level. Yeah, but yeah. Normally, Imagine that. That's, I like, that's, like, what happens to me in every game. Normally, I don't game. get mad at games. And this started when I was, I was a League streamer. I remember, like, my chat would always be like, it's crazy how, like, you never get tilted. Or, like, I would, like, get tilted, but it'd be, like, exaggerated. Yeah. Because like, it's just a game, bro. I don't know. I don't think I've ever gotten actually mad at, like, a Souls game. Really? I've really? been mad at it. I feel like that can't be true. Mm -mm. You didn't get angry at, um... Uh, oh, uh, Manus? Yep. No. I, wa I wasn't angry. I was just like, fuck. <laughs> like, yeah. I don't know if I can beat it. <laughs> and then you it's ended up losing that, that bet that people made. I remember that. That oh, was a good a, day for me. Well, yeah, that's a good-ass question. Is there anything that you miss about life before you became a renowned streamer? Oh, yeah. Dude, I used to smoke so many cigarettes. It was ridiculous. Ew. I miss that shit Why every day. Why don't you smoke cigarettes on stream? Uh, no, I, I don't want to smoke anymore. Why are you going to get them addicted? Like, is it secondhand smoke? That's nasty. Dude, I get, like, cigarettes make me so happy, but I've been clean for, like, four years. I just can't do it anymore, man. But they're the best. Don't Fuck. smoke cigarettes. They're bad. Yeah, people told me that I would miss them, or I wouldn't miss them after I stopped. I haven't. But I just continue to not do them because they're not good for you. Nobody should smoke. They're horribly addictive. That's pretty much the only thing, man. Cigarettes. I'm going to be totally honest. Everything in my life is completely the same. I believe that. Like, whenever I had 100,000 viewers, 
it was the same as whenever I had a hundred dollars. So here's a question. I think maybe it changed a little bit. Did you order as much Chipotle before you? Well, the only reason I do that is because I don't have a car. Well, you had a car. Yeah, you, you would go in person, right? Yeah, I go in person all the time. Yeah, but did you have money to afford Chipotle before streaming? Well, before streaming, there really wasn't even Chipotle hardly at all. It wasn't even that popular. So then what was it, Taco Bell? Uh, yeah, we'll go to Taco Bell. I go to Wendy's, go to uh, Jack in the Box. How did you make money before you were streaming? So that's the funny thing. Welfare? No. Um, you didn't? Well, I mean, there's a lot of ways. And, uh, I mean, you could make money a lot of different things you could do. Oh, yeah, I know I could, but how did you? Um, well, I mean, I worked at the IRS for a while. Okay. And. So is that like being a narc or no? Uh, no, <laughs> not really. I mean, like. Okay. I, I mean, it was like I would. I mm. loved working at the IRS, actually. I really did. It was such a great place. And, uh, yeah, that was pretty much what I did for oh, a little good. bit. Oh, yeah. What about you, Emmy? Anything I missed before becoming a... Wait, did you say, like, re renowned? Renowned? Renowned, yeah. Renowned streamer? Um, I mean, it's kind of the same. Like, before I was a streamer, I would just play games and not go out much besides school. But, I mean, probably, like... I mean, this is kind of, like, not, like, a fun answer, but, like, privacy, I guess. Why? So you is basically what you're saying is that you miss not having stalkers and crazy people try to insert themselves into your personal life? Yeah. Yeah, I, I mean, could well, see that. I, that makes sense. I did have yeah. some some of those experiences before I was a streamer, but it definitely got a little bit worse, I would say, after I became a streamer. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> I've that got. Fun. <laughs> yeah, I mean, <laughs> I'm sorry. Like, I, I was like, "What's like a fun answer?" But it's like, I mean, I don't know. Like, I I feel like being a streamer, like most of your life, really isn't that different. Or well, you know, for some people, it things. is. It is like some people love doing all kinds of crazy different stuff, and you know, like, oh wow, I'm a streamer. My life is so crazy. It's so fun. No, it's but not. for me, I I always really liked my life. I really did. I didn't do anything. I would try to live off the government as much as I could. Damn right. I, if I had to get money in some other way, I'd just do it and, like, you know, get home at 3 in the morning. Mom makes me cupcakes, play WoW until 5 in the morning, <laughs> pass out, wake up at 1 p.m., walk down to 7-Eleven, get a hot dog. Fuck. Dude, what else could, could it be? You could still, You could still do that. Yeah, I know. You could hire a, an adult nanny. Yeah? That would be sick. Like a girlfriend. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but okay, that's a the good one. The other one's way easier. <laughs> yeah, you could hire one of those, like, live-in caretakers for elderly people that can't walk. Oh, yeah. That's a good idea. Yeah, you know, you know, uh, you ever heard of Soapland, Asmund? Soapland? Yeah, you ever heard of Soapland? That's called a bathroom. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's this place in Japan called Soapland. I'll get to that in a second. That's just fucking wild to me. There's a place in Japan called Soapland where uh, it's a bathhouse. Right, and you can pay these women to give you a bath, right? Oh wait, that's what they it have is? that in Turkey too. I thought it was too. just a normal bathhouse. No, 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 no. Oh my god, you don't know what I was getting at? No. Is this like a so, sex thing? So okay, so prostitution's illegal, right? Why is it illegal, well, dude? <laughs> okay, so prostitution in Japan's illegal because they oh, think it's bad. Like we now, I'm we were, okay. now I'm no, interested. Now I'm interested. No, 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 Emmy. Don't, so in Japan, okay, yeah, in Japan, they have this shit called Soapland. <laughs> yeah. Where you get all these beautiful Japanese women and they soap <laughs> themselves up and they wash you using their body, right? And they rub you up. And uh -huh. then if they like you, then they'll fuck you. I, I'm sure that they all like them. Depending that's on how crazy. Much right, yeah. right. And yeah. that's how depends they get how around it. Yeah, depends because on you how pay much them for the service right. of them rubbing you up. Oh, yeah. And then they'll, it won't be vaginal, but anything else I besides that. I was thinking that. like, because yeah, that, that's interesting because like I saw a video of this and it was Turkey and it was the same thing, but yep. it was just a bunch of fat, hairy men doing it to Damn each other. Damn right. I didn't go to I Turkey, like, man. Yeah, I was like, what the fuck? That sounds good. And to be honest with you, if I had to choose, this is going to sound so... Like, uh, there's a lot of things that I do that sound gay as fuck. And this is <laughs> okay, another Okay, like what? Well, I think that men in general are more attractive than women. <laughs> 
That does sound a little bit gay. And, I, and like you, clapping and like you could see, you could see how, in a circumstance, people would think that saying that men are more attractive than women on average means that you could well, be gay. Yeah. Do you mean like the average man is more likely to be good attractive, looking yeah. than the average woman? Yeah, absolutely. I disagree. I also disagree. I think yeah. women are beautiful. Yeah, I think. The uh, well, I'm woman... not a liar, so I don't. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Maybe I'm just, I don't know, man. I feel like, I feel like on average, I even sometimes think, why yeah. the fuck would women date men when we look like this? Well, it's not about that. It's like, there are like all these girls that have like all these skin problems and everything and like all Do these men issues. Not have skin problems? No, men don't have skin problems. That's for girls. Nobody you has. You know why them. I think that argument is wrong? Why? Because women use makeup. Exactly, because they need to. Dude, what are you saying? Holy shit, this guy's fucking based. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, you guys don't like, have to do that. No, but women get to cheat, right? They can just, if, if they're ugly, bada bing, bada boom. You know? Yeah. Easy peasy. Well, a guy can cheat too. That's but they called a beard. True. Yeah, there you yes, go. Yes, sir. And so, yeah, no, there's that. And so that's gay. But the other one I was going to say is that, yeah, I would rather go to the turkey bathhouse then get washed up by a bunch of like Japanese chicks. Dude, so you, you are just gay. He's no, being like, no, it's, women are ugly. It, this, it's not. They need makeup. Then he's like, but I'm not gay though. Well, but it's, that's not, <laughs> and it's not that they're ugly. It's just that like, it's not like I'm attracted to men. Okay, here's a question. I, it's just two different things. What do you like more? The what? appearance of dicks or vaginas? I mean, I don't know. What do you mean? What do you think on the average? Fact that he doesn't just what have What do you an think looks better, a like, dick or a vagina? I, I mean, this is like, it's like, are well, you talking about like my personal opinion? Yes. Yeah. Or like a, a vagina, obviously, right? Oh, I think dicks look better. Okay. So that means I like. Hate, I hate y'all. So, like, so. That little moment. I, I live, hate y'all. I live for those little moments of just. Oh, man, that shit kills me, bro. Holy fuck. Yeah. Uh, it's crazy. Uh, so. Yep. I was like saying, like, yeah, it's like, because if you. That's the same reason I never go to like Hooters or something like that. Yeah, like, I don't fuck wanna, all these women. I don't want to do that. I don't want to be thinking about some hot chick. I just want to eat my chicken. Like, leave me the fuck alone. I love it. Yeah, I want to be like, hey, I just want to say to all the women out there, yeah. I think you're beautiful with or without makeup. Watch That's my right. stream, not this fucking losers. Oh, That's right. Right. Hey, hey, just don't worry. Just follow my stream. Don't go over there. Hey, That's don't right. worry. This They're chat is awful. Okay? They they were never going to watch me to begin with. Okay. Yep. That's true. And if they do, it would only just, be once. I just thought I should call it out, you know. Yep. Yeah. Oh, I know. Oh, wait. What's this? Did you ever make each so mad you stopped talking to each other? Well, people wait. have gotten mad. People have gotten mad at me before. Yeah. I mean, I'm sure you guys were probably pissed off before I got here today. Guaranteed y'all were pissed off. No. Nah. And yep, yeah, you I've were. I've never been so mad that I stopped talking to either of you. I have genuinely never been angry at y'all a single time. I never get mad at people, really. I feel yeah. like there's like one time I was mad at Techie, like a long time yep. ago, like a year and a half ago. Yep, I remember that. Oh, yeah. I remember, I remember that. Here. Yes, there was sir. That. I remember that. Yeah, yeah the, I remember this, that. That was, that was the one time. Episode. Yeah, there was, there was yeah. one time. <laughs> Wait, should we even talk about that? No, I'm good. And then, <laughs> I'm good. There's one time I got mad at Tectone. But yep. That that was like a, I apologized to him like three hours later. Or something. Yeah, no, we're all good. <laughs> I hit her car. <laughs> That's not what happened. I'm trying to think, has there been any, been any, anybody in OTK I've been mad at? Uh, shit, probably Miz. That's about it. Maybe like one time. Hey, I'm not answering this question. I don't. Wanna, I don't oh, wanna okay, yeah. What's, no, what's what technological advancement do you want to live long enough to see happen? Oh, dude, I got wait. Technological? Yeah. I want to see robots that look exactly like normal humans. Why do you want to see that? I don't know. It'd be cool. Yeah, it'd be cool too. I think it'd be really cool. I want to see that too. <laughs> yeah, I think I just want uh, the Apple Pro to be able to make it feel like I'm inside of like a like a video game or some shit. That's pretty much Four it. Hour line. Yeah, it's like really good Apple Apple Pro shit. You know, that way I can go inside the world of explain why? Oh, because being inside of Nikkei would be crazy. That's a good choice. Yep, Nikkei would be insane. But the, isn't the, like the whole story like a post apocalyptic like death like meat grinder and you just die instantly? It's like the Matrix, like this the third Matrix. I don't movie. know. I just look at big yeah. old anime boobies. Oh and, yeah, yeah. Uh, for so that sure. shit's good. You can do that already. Yeah. And what? How do you know? On the internet. How do you know? I mean, I've seen, I mean, how do you know? I've seen VR chat. 
So I haven't played it, but I, because I, I have severe motion sickness. Oh, okay. Wait, there was an actual question. Okay, technological advancement. There's this one that's coming out in 2025, uh, allegedly, where apparently it's a serum that you inject into your your dogs and cats that prevent them from having kidney issues because the majority of these animals have kidney issues and it's going to extend their lifespan by like five to ten years. What That's could, what I've heard. I could be completely wrong. I also saw that Putin has the cure to cancer. It's a vaccine to cancer. <laughs> yeah, he actually? He's going to solve it. Oh. He's going to take care of it. They're going to just <laughs> figure it out. That's going to be done. Oh, okay. I mean, that would solve a lot of problems for people, you know? Uh -huh. They should make a cure to a lot of stuff, like headaches, ibuprofen, Aspirin. like being bald. I think that they're going to come up with a cure for being bald more than, you know, actually, I, actually, uh, no, Emmy, you were in the meeting. I remember I asked Ashley, I, I said, I, I have now begun. I, I told oh, you guys, yeah. I promised like two years ago that I would do a hair transplant or hair restoration thing consultation either on stream or on video the hunt is on and i will probably be doing that i i have begun doing this just Don't get a you wig have to shave your head after you get a hair transplant yeah like you nuts. do she's gonna go actually bald i'm gonna be no, actually gonna bald yeah out. well you're going stone cold gold i might have to <laughs> stone cold gold. but i don't know if that's gonna happen or not like Wait, yeah so i'm gonna be the only bald fuck now it probably won't work it will it's pretty hard to, for it to not work I guarantee you that there's a way I could do it wrong. You won't find it, though. Yeah. Could you each say your favorite time asthma gold was wrong? Emma, you first. There was, like, one take that you did that I <laughs> disagreed with so much. I saw it on Reddit. I'm trying Good. to remember what it was. It was a while ago. I actually... I just think about this. I don't remember. I know you've been wrong about something, but I don't remember nothing. Yeah, I don't remember either. People say you're wrong all the time about some bullshit, and I don't really ever get that. Uh, shit. Well, a lot of times it's not <laughs> that they oh. think he's wrong. They just, the way he says it is very, um, It's, it's the worst way possible. No, here we go. Yeah, like, uh, when yeah. you, you said the thing about people just leaving when, like, the water was poisoned or something. That's right. It's like... Well, you know, okay, whenever like, whenever the like kids have cancer and, and they have, you know, <laughs> babies with seven fingers, I'm sure, you know, they're going to be thinking oh, yeah, about their also, financial you situation. You also said that strawberries were fucking disgusting. Yeah. No, the number that one was dog shit. The number one thing was uh when you said that you just should stop bathing. That's fucking gross. Oh yeah, you said like uh you watched something that said like, "Oh, you, you don't wash your hair." And you're like, "I'm just going to stop washing my yeah, hair." Yeah, that shit was actually fucking insane. Do you want to know what's <laughs> funny about that? Sure. It worked. You think so? What yep. worked? So basically, I was beginning to evolve. And what yep. was happening is that my skin was becoming hard like an armor. And I would no longer get hot or cold. I would just always feel a good, reasonable temperature. And I didn't shower at all for two months, actually almost three months. Neither of you ever complained about it or talked about it or said anything. Did I smell bad? Do you do you think that's because you didn't smell bad or because maybe we didn't want to be rude? Well, I think it's actually because I didn't smell bad. Oh, well, I do. Been doing this podcast for a year, so like you know, like you've been like living in something for a while. You can't smell it anymore. No, that's not. No, no, no. Because you know, you go into somebody's house, you can smell it just for a few seconds. That's not what it was. And so I, the reason oh. why I stopped showering and stopped bathing for like three months is that I had a skin problem where like my skin would flake off and it would be like really oily a lot and it was like very bad and so i figured that why am i even showering if it's just going to lead to the same problem that usually means it's dry like you need to moisturize exactly and where does the moisture come from inside your body yeah it's what because i do with this the... is a it is oh a self-regulating machine yeah it's what i've been and doing so... too with uh, taking shits i just don't wipe anymore because i'm like oh, i'm gonna just shit again that's so the I... liver king strat i like that yeah i just let it crust there ain't no yeah. way y'all <laughs> Not y'all. He was talking about Not. how men are more attractive than women. And this is a real conversation happening Well, right this now. is something that a man can do. A girl couldn't do that. That'd be gross. Yeah, she could. Yeah, because they're too weak. Now they're too weak-minded. Yeah. Women are strong <laughs> can't enough. <laughs> they can't handle it. <laughs> oh, my God. I can't stand this shit. Yeah? This is the last episode. Is that I right? I'm done after this Imagine week. Imagine that. Uh -huh. Oh, this is a fun question. 
If you could pick anyone to become the fourth member of Steak and Eggs, who would you pick? I have a great one. I'll, I'll say last. Uh, uh, for me, soda. Soda popping. Oh, my God. I would kill myself. What? Why? Oh, Jesus Christ. I cannot stand being around that guy. Holy fuck. Yeah, you guys have beef, huh? Now, our personality just conflicts. I, like, I think soda's great. <clears throat> Not for me, though. Oh, Sears here. Hi, Sears. Hi, Sears. See, that's why it's fun that this is live. <laughs> Yeah, no, I mean, I, I, I like soda. Syrup, syrup be great on this too. Yeah, but like, I like when syrup. I'm, syrup, syrup is so It's like good. it's like hanging out with my dad, right? He's just gonna fucking yell at me the whole soda fucking time. Is like your dad? Yeah, soda's like my dad. Yeah, he yells at me for dude. He berated me in an airport because I was wearing a tank top. Soda's old now too, isn't he? He's yeah. like thirty. Yep, he's gonna have a kid soon too. That's wow. Yep, because he's pregnant. Don't know if you guys know that. Jesus, Blake. how'd you find that out? I asked her. Oh really? She said, "Yep." I thought you found it from like Twitter, Twitter users. <laughs> no, like asking. figured out they're like, oh, she didn't stream for five days, and <laughs> yep. yeah, I guess that means she's pregnant. Yeah. What about you, fourth member? I would say maybe even Seer, maybe uh, Tips would be good. As a permanent um, member? Oh, well, I don't know. Maybe yeah, because like you always talk. Like I always have stuff to talk about with Tips, especially like drama shit like that. Interesting. I've oh, never yeah. thought that in a million years. Oh yeah. But obviously he wouldn't agree to that. Oh yeah. Because no, he's he too wouldn't. busy. Oh no. Yeah, very true. I think I think uh, I think Will Neff. I would Will be Neff is such a good host. He's he so is. good. He's incredible. Very funny. Best energy. One of the best human beings I've ever met. To me, like it's like anybody you bring on, you go get a, ho a hobo. You know, go go collect one, right? <laughs> yeah. And uh, go catch one, and uh, bring him back, and I'll talk to him. You know, it doesn't matter to me. It's fine. Dude, actually, or my dad. Yeah. Yeah, my dad, dad would be insane. We never did an episode with uh, either of your dads. If you guys give me the okay, I will have him here Well, they any keep week. talking about doing an episode where it's still me, but then his dad replaces him and his dad replaces him. Oh and my then they God. just talk at me. I actually think yeah. that's a really bad idea when I think about it. It is a really bad idea. I feel, I think, like. Yeah, I feel like if my dad's Based here... Based off what y'all have told me about your yeah, dad. I need to be here if my dad's here. Because he's a... Uh, you have to rein him in. Yep. Control him from saying something. And there's no way in fuck we can do it live. Yeah. <laughs> Zero percent <laughs> chance. Do you uh, guys love Texas as a place to live compared to your previous places? I don't care where I live. I just, like, I, I mean, if I was living right now in New York, I'd be fine. If I was living in L.A., I'd be fine. If I was living in, uh, you know, Portland, Oregon, I'd be fine. Uh, yeah. I just, like, the most important thing to me is that where is the Wendy's? Where is the Taco Bell? How far away is the gas station where I can get a drink at? So do I really give a fuck? No, I don't. Like if somebody told me I had to live in L.A., I'd be like, okay. I mean, every place you can live is something annoying. The most annoying thing about Texas care. for me is how far apart everything is. Like the drive. That's because I mean, you live in that fucking piece of shit place. Oh it's in the middle of nowhere. It's but, a I mean, shithole. Like, lives you know, in a shithole. You shit live hole. in LA or New York. It's like. That's so you know, crazy. Texas, you say their house is In Texas, it's hole, like 50 bro. miles away. In oh LA, it's like gosh. a mile away, but it takes the same amount of time to it's get not there. Like so that it's like, for is me. there really a difference? It's not like that for me. Uh, for me, I think genuinely Austin, Texas is the best place on earth. I love this place. It's a really nice place. Yeah, I mean, the, the, the thing for me is the air quality here is so goddamn good. Uh, I barely have any asthma because I'm surrounded by just trees everywhere. I love this place. Only thing that sucks is summer gets hot. I just turn on the AC. I love it personally. Don't leave the house. And like yep. I have that my solution to summer is that I wake up whenever the sun goes down. And then whenever the sun comes back up, I say, all right, I'm done. Yep. I'll go back to sleep. When will the three of you play a game together on stream? Tecton forced me to write this. Well, we were going to the other day with Helldivers, Tecton but we'll do it to again. Write this earlier. What? Uh, okay. Did, did you really do that? No. Yeah, no. I mean, we'll we'll do we'll do a game pretty soon. I think. I think that'd be a good Helldivers idea. Helldivers probably. Yeah, yeah, that could be good. I mean, there's plenty of fucking games. Like, there's so many games. Like, I've uh, Last Epoch came out yesterday. Did y'all play that? Mm -hmm. No, nah, I watched uh, my homie Mtash play it. Ooh, it's. Uh, she looks good. Looks really good. Looks very good. I'm gonna go home. I'm gonna play it all night. And uh, one to ten, uh, I would say it's a solid nine. Damn, it's it's a good game. Uh, what about Grand Blue Relink? You play that? No, no, no. I did my sponsor that oh, quick. What do you think about um, Wuthering Waves? Oh, oh yeah, because you were talking all. I saw, about dude. That. I yep. called out your video name. 
Did you? Wait, what was so it? I keep releasing these videos where it's this game changed my life. <laughs> oh yeah. Right? And so yeah. I'll keep releasing these and like these videos get like a million views and it's a fucking VOD. Yep. And so uh, like I was making jokes about it and then either Tectone or Tectone's editor uploaded a video and it's this game changed my life yep. and it's a video and like the thumbnail is Tectone. <laughs> yep. Did yep. it work though? That's the important thing. Yes. Part. Yes, it did. Yes. <laughs> That's the best. And part. you know what's crazy? Do you know how many times I've done that? How many? I've been doing that since Hollow Cure. Because you've oh, been after? doing that since Hollow Cure. I was yeah. like, damn, that shit works pretty good, huh? Okay. It's smart. There, this game saved my life. So what do you think about it? Uh, incredible. So how what do you think about the fact that you see did you see whenever I got I was doing my spends on the game? Genuinely, I was really happy for you. Really? Yep. I was yeah. stoked because that character is so fucking cool. He's so badass. How much do y'all spend? Zero dollars. Zero dollars. CBT. I, I, oh. I, tried, yeah. oh, okay. I tried to wail on the beta. It won't let you. Yep. I got, uh, I got, uh, I got uh, the child. Ooh, wow. So you know what I did? Loser. Didn't, didn't use her. That's Single smart. Time. Fuck that, bro. That shit is so cringe. Now everybody's been getting Kakarot and fucking uh, Gen Zing. Oh fuck, it. dude. It is. It is everything I've wanted in a gotcha game. Why? Why? What do you like about it? Uh, okay, so I'm not sure. Have you seen the combat that happens later in the game once you reach uh, like the mid tier and the, the late game tier? You mean like forty, like around there? Like like fifty, like fifty. No, 60. I mean I, I I was gonna watch some videos about it. I haven't had time. Yeah. So they added more mechanics to the fights. Yeah, I know that. Like, yeah. I remember whenever I fought the crownless guy the first time that we did it, mm -hmm. it was like a lot easier. And like now he has more things that he does. Yep. And uh, if you level up even more, he's gonna get even more things. What type of combat is this? Uh, um, it's like Genshin. Oh, okay. Genshin with like a perfect dodges and perfect parries, uh, and then intro and outro skills. And each character has a it's character chill. passive, so it's very fun. But there's no elemental system. But uh, yeah, no, it's yeah, really fun. Is. Huh? Yeah, there is. Like, there's like attacks. Oh, no, like no, no elemental interplay. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, uh, yeah, it looks really fucking good. Um, I, I think it's actually going to be a, just a fucking banger hit. And you know what's crazy? Even if it's not, I don't care. Even if the video gets, even if the, even if the, the gameplay gets zero views, I don't care. I'm going to play it regardless. Because it's just, it's genuinely fucking fun. They even have a Pokemon hunting system in it. It's so cool. And whatever Pokemon you catch, you can use those as your artifacts to, like, make your character stronger. I don't know, man. I'm stoked. And there can be shinies. They're shinies? Yeah, they're shinies. What do you mean Wait, shinies? That just reminded dude, Pal World was like a week. <laughs> yep. I think a lot of people, well, people played the game, they yeah, beat the game. Did. Yeah, right? exactly. But I feel like there was so much stuff to do in it. No, I, I did everything. Oh. Yeah, like, so for example, I, I got every pal. I collected every item. I killed every single legendary. I did every cave. I did everything. I beat the fucking game. I was breeding together legendary Pokemon against each other, you know? I really hate when people say it's a dead game because people aren't playing it right now. It's like, yeah, bro, they beat the game and they stopped it. It's like, yeah, oh, yeah, Banjo Kazooie is a dead, is a dead, dead game. game. It's like, no, it's True. not. True, Banjo Kazooie is a dead game. Stop. Yeah. True. <laughs> oh, dude. Uh, would you consider uploading your consciousness to the cloud if such an option became Ooh, available? Oh, like that one show, yeah. Um, why the fuck would I not? Yeah, yeah of course not? I'd do Wait, that. But is yeah. it per there's no, it's not permanent, right? Like, you could delete yourself, like, kill yourself. Why would virtually. you want to delete yourself? I don't know. Like, what if you get really bored? Like, you've been no. in the cloud for, like, millions no, of years. No, somebody come up with some new game. I'll play that instead. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, no, I would immediately, <coughs> without hesitation. That would be fucking incredible. Yeah, why, why not? And then I would transfer myself into, like... A beautiful woman's body, and then I would start an OnlyFans, and I would chill out so fucking hard, bro. Bro, I would throw ass for money without hesitation. Really? That dude, that is my dream life, man. Holy fuck! Imagine that. You wake up, you throw ass for thirty Your minutes. Your dream is to be an OnlyFans model. Absolutely. Wow. Wake up, throw ass, I read on the internet. Beautiful. I mean, that was better than my dream. My dream was yeah. to live off of welfare. Yep. <laughs> Dream come true, by the way. There you go. But dude, then like all the comments. What was your dream, Emmy? Oh, is this one of those times I should stop talking? <laughs> okay. My dream. I picked up on it. To have a lot of friends and talk to a lot of people. Oh, well, you'll get there well. one day. Thanks, man. Yeah, no wow. Yeah. Uh, yeah. That's sad. Why is that sad? Well, I mean, imagine. I mean, you know. I think that's better than living off welfare as your dream. Why? 
Think like, about it like you, this. What are you going to do? Well, really you, can, you have plenty of time to make friends. Oh, that's true. Speaking of friends, who in Shmibu underscore 47 says, who in OTK would you like to switch lives with? You want to know why I love this question? Because we've already answered this on the Patreon. Which, by the way, we'll be doing a Patreon. Epi- yes, we'll be doing a Patreon episode uh, after this. If any of you guys want to go check that out, it's uh, patreoncom slash I don't remember answering this. I do. I remember exactly I mean, what I said. I don't know if I answered differently, but honestly, no, no one. You have to pick. You can't say no one. It's a question. It doesn't say pick and one person. Pick somebody. You have to switch lives. With. Yes. Soda. Why? I feel like he's living the best life. Like. He's just chilling. He plays whatever the fuck he wants. You know, he has a girlfriend. He's got a dog. He just lives in his house. He's whatever the fuck he wants. I feel like, you know, he has the best life. Nah, there's no way. Then who? Who has a better life? Will. Yeah, Will's a good life, too. Will Neff has a fucking great life. Uh, would I want to swap with it? No. Uh, I would like to swap with S-Fan, though. I would swap with S Fan 100%. You want to stream GTA for 14 hours a day? No, fuck no. I want his body. Why? Because he's huge. And that man, if he were to properly train, could move mountains. Well, you know, he played college football, right? Yeah, but I'm saying now, you know, yeah. he's falling off. He's, he plays streams. He should be in the fucking well, he gym. He's falling off. I, I think it's great that he's lost weight. I do. I think it's really good. No, I think it's good that he's lost yeah. weight. But I'm saying. Strength building. He could I get pro- that. He could probably set records with his build. He's I mean, he used to bench like he told me like four fifty something like that. Exactly. Holy shit. That's what oh, I'm yeah. saying. Get back there. Dude. Let's get back there. Yeah. Because even on Camp Canute, like for season one, he was insane. Like mm-hmm. bro was moving weights. My frame is not nearly that big. Yeah. And I just think it would be cool to experience that amount of raw explosive power until my bones broke. Yeah. Okay. That's a good answer. He's like he's like Midoriya. Has all this power, but he keeps breaking all of his fucking bones. That's so true. <laughs> oh, my God. Poor fan. What about you, Asma? It actually sucks. What would I want to change body? I mean, I'll be honest. I told you all, like, I never want to change with anybody. I, I, but you had to. Everybody always complains about shit wrong with them. Like, you know, I'm chilling. Uh, but you had I, to. Don't, I don't know. I mean, maybe sodas. I mean, basically, soda does yes. the same thing that I do. Yeah, that's actually yeah. So it's like, yeah, it's like if I did that, I just don't have to change anything, really. Yeah, I have a bit more hair, and I'm I'm shorter. It's a bit of a trade off. Kawhi Dango says, "What is the one game you would stop from being created?" One game. If I could go back in time and stop a game from being created, obviously. Legend of no. What? what no, the fuck? no. I, sorry, I, I was, I was trying, I was thinking of something that I just, just came out wrong. Is there any um, answer besides League? Because for a second, I thought Legend of Zelda. Um, uh, <laughs> what was it? Uh, Wind Waker. But then I was like, no, oh, that's not really? really true. You didn't like that one? It, was, it had that cartoon I bullshit. Love that What's one. that cartoon? Yeah, because you grew up with it. I didn't. I grew up the real shit. Well, I, I played Legend, all of them. You played Legend of Zelda: Link to the Past. Mm-hmm. Okay, what happens? I don't fucking remember. Is that the one with the egg? That's Awakening. Oh, fuck. I don't know. I don't remember. I haven't played, like, Oracles, Ages, and Seasons and stuff, but this was, been, like, in elementary school. Yeah, Oracle it, and Ages were so good. Yeah. That, like, I wish, I wish they would remake that. If I could stop a game from being made, it would be Oblivion. Why? Think. Because it's one of the best games ever made? Well, obviously, I don't want other people to be happy. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. It's because what? of the it's oh, because the- of the horse. <laughs> oh, the horse DLC. DLC. Damn, damn, damn. Well, it would have still happened eventually. Yeah, I probably. would probably I would probably remove one of the video games that has caused one of the worst fan bases in existence. I have never met a good person who's liked this game. Uh, yeah, I'd probably just remove Kirby to be honest. What? Uh, do you have any old friends or family that stopped <laughs> talking to you once you became famous? Uh, I had the exact opposite. No, I mean, I, I, I don't really worry about any of that. I mean, people don't like what I do. I don't give a fuck. Yeah, why, why would they stop talking to you? Yeah, it's more like they'd want you to give them yeah, money I, or something, more like right? The opposite. Yeah, I've had yeah. people ask me for money. Tons. Or like people that... I've had a lot of people from from school that like i knew them but we weren't friends they'll tell people like oh yeah we were such good friends in high school like yeah i know her yep like we used to talk all the time and i'm like no we didn't i don't know so so here's the problem (laughs) i'm having i anybody who i stopped talking to before content creation 
I refuse to talk to anymore because I have a paranoia that they're trying to come back to my life just for money. Because there's this person who's just been messaging me like every day for like five years. And I'm just like, well, I'm good. So, hey, if you're every watching this, don't talk to me. five years? Yep. Well, what happens for me is usually they'll like, they'll hit me up and be like, hey, like, it's been a while. And like, it, it'll be like a really nice conversation, you know, like, we'll just be catching up. And then about a week later, they'll be like, I've been thinking about trying streaming. And I'm like, that's Great, cool. man. You, you can do that. Like, you're free to do that. And then like, I'll, they'll be like, yeah. And then they just won't talk to me again. Dude. This I, has happened like seven or eight times. I had a heartbreaking experience. I reconnected with, with an old buddy. This is when I drew the line. I reconnected with an old buddy. And things were all chilling. And then it's like, oh, yeah, I've been seeing you uh, been blowing up on content creation later or lately. Really, really good, man. Hey, uh, 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 we should do a podcast together. And I'm like, oh, my God. And I'm just like, no, nah, I'm good, man. I'm good. Fuck, bro. It's so depressing. I usually assume that people that I, I this sounds bad, but I usually assume whenever somebody is awkward, it's because of their own lack of social understanding. And so, like, I think that usually people say something like that with relatively not super bad intentions. They just think that it's like some cool thing that they could do or whatever. And I don't really take it that seriously or whatever. Mm -hmm. Like, I grew up like I, I didn't have as any siblings, but in a way I had like about, I don't know, seven or eight little brothers, yeah. like uh, different people in like my neighborhood. And, you know, I was one of the older ones, the second oldest. And uh so I would be very used to, you know, somebody, he's, yeah, can I have a Dr. Pepper? Can I play on the Xbox? Can I have this? And so if people ask me for something, I'm like, yeah, huh, yeah, I know how this is. Well, I mean, I have had friends that I'm pretty close yeah. to show interest in streaming because yeah. I do it. I don't think there's anything wrong with that. Like, streaming is fun. But what I was talking about is people that, like, they open the conversation they're only interested in talking about, like, how do I stream, and then they leave. Yeah. It's like, you know what? Oh, that's, that's fine. okay. They don't have to, like, want to be my friend. It's just, personally, I find it a little off-putting. I don't, doesn't bother me at all. I don't, I don't bother, I don't mind that. It doesn't, it doesn't, it's okay with me. People say whatever they want. It yeah, takes a lot for somebody to make me uncomfortable. I think it takes a lot to make you uncomfortable in general. Like, as you, bro, you don't even shower. No. Yeah, like, I think you have a very high tolerance level. Well, I mean, it's uh, there's a well. Yeah, the other day, my faucet, my water stopped working. This is like maybe two days ago. Yeah. And so I decided to. So like, remember how I said I, I didn't shower at all yeah. for like months, and now I'm trying the opposite, where I'm going to shower multiple times a week. I just want to make sure. Did you notice that somebody in chat says Earth Shield stacks? Yeah, and it's true. <laughs> <laughs> and That's insane. You're gonna, you're gonna remove all your stacks. Yeah. I know. Yeah. Well, it's it's. I'm respecking. And Holy so, uh, shit. yeah. You, you need to do like a video. Yeah. Where you you try a full self care routine for a full week. Like, you wash your face. You moisturize. You use retinol. You use like. Some I'd probably real have to do it for a month soap. to see if it would be a difference. But I would do that. Sure. You should. You should do that. And like. What are some other self care things? Do you like supplements. the uh, supplements? I do the intro of like American Psycho. <laughs> oh, that'd be oh, good. Yeah. yeah, that would work. I would be willing to do that. Sure. No, I actually would. Cause yeah, I, I so basically the water just stopped coming through the faucet. I that am, was it. I am curious how much better you would feel if you took fish oil every day for a month. Fish oil? I think you would feel so much better. It's absurd. Maybe by that time I'd be able to breathe underwater. Yep, <laughs> you would. i take fish oil every day. It's Why the, would you do that? Uh, it's Why an anti, it's an anticoagulant. Fish? Leave them alone. <laughs> I know. Leave them alone, man. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, don't worry. It's, uh, it's ethically. They, the fish donate it themselves. Oh, really? Yeah, this it one. It was consented? Yeah, they consent. They say, here you That's go, good. mister. Yeah, it's anticoagulant. So it helps your blood flow better, which makes uh, less headaches. I only get headaches whenever I have to do something I don't want to do. It's like, like every day. Yeah, I have a headache right now. I'm just kidding. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, did somebody just say fish oil doesn't work and that it's legit placebo? I, would, I wouldn't I would be surprised if that were true. I would be shocked. Fish oil does it work. I'm sure it's good for you. But I mean, what you're saying that like it makes your brain flow better. I don't know about that. A large study showed that people who took pure EPA fish oil pill reduced their risk of cardiovascular disease by 25%. That 
That's a good benefit. Studies suggest fish oil supplements help reduce pain, improve morning stiffness, and relieve joint tenderness in people with uh, rheumatoid arthritis. What arthritis? R- rheumatoid arthritis. I mean, well, I uh, it's rheumatoid arth- arthritis. That's pretty much it. <laughs> I have no fucking idea what that yeah, means, man. Yeah, it smells bad, so. Yeah, I got no that. fucking idea. Ugh. All right, so while he's not here, let's just address the elephant in the room. Do you actually think Asma smells good? I mean, I've never gotten that close to him to, like, smell anything. And I have, I've never smelled, like, a body odor on him. Okay, so here's the question. Uh, I've never seen Asmund with his arms up. Right? Uh-huh. So what if we just somehow say, let's see who can sit like this the longest. And then... I'll go over there and just give it an old whiff, you know, and I'll yeah. give it the old test. That's what I'll do. Okay. We'll, uh... this, did you see the clip of uh, Emily and Caroline? Uh, I've seen a lot it's of clips like, of Emily. I, f- I feel like when you get in there, even if someone has like the no strong bio gene, it will smell. That's what I'm thinking. Um, he also, I don't know how often he does laundry. It's like his clothes might smell like a little moldy. Wait, is he back? Oh. No, he's still in the bathroom. Oh, wait, he's back. Wait. I've never thought of that. <laughs> I've never thought of that. You don't think... Yo. <laughs> hey, man. Hey, just curious. How often do you do laundry? Uh... Oh, okay. So remember whenever we did the shareholders meeting last year, whenever we announced the podcast? Yeah. I washed a shirt for that. Okay. Um, how, when, when did you do it last, though? That's what I mean. You don't do laundry? No. How about I come smell you? That is not a new shirt, by the way. Like, that shirt's, like, worn out. How would you feel with me entering your personal space and smelling you? Because I've never actually done it. I'm I always actually, over here. I actually did sweat a little bit on the way over here. I was r- pretty stressed out because I was really late. Okay. So I might smell not so great. But, okay. uh, yeah, you could smell me maybe next time. Next time? Yeah, that sounds next good. Next time? Okay. Yeah, it'll be probably just be the What's same shirt. What's the difference okay. going to be if you're not going to do laundry or shower between now and then, though? Okay. Mm. Well, it'll evaporate. The sweat will evaporate. Okay, so no, next time. We'll do, we'll do a live, uh, a live smell, a smell oh, test. God, it's terrible. Because, I, I mean, shit, maybe he's right. I just think because I'm over here, you know, I don't go. My nose yeah. barely works, too, so I don't fucking know, but we'll try. Do you guys have any goals that you want to achieve that have no relation with streaming? Oh, absolutely, bro. Hopefully. I mean, yeah, surely. To be fair, I've started to give a lot less of a fuck about, you know, certain hitting these numbers, hitting those numbers. I don't really give a fuck, uh, to be fair. Uh, but it is nice when it happens, but I haven't been actively aiming for it. Uh, I just want to be able to bench 315 pounds. That's what I want. That's yeah, you can be able to do that. Yeah, yeah, I'm at I'm at right now. I can do like 235 or 245, maybe like once. So I want to get like 70 more pounds. That's my goal for the end of Camp Canute, because my goal for the first Camp Canute was 225. Second season, I want to do 315. All right. Yeah. Uh, for me, a goal that doesn't do with streaming. Uh, I've been doing a hundred days drawing challenge. I want to get really good at drawing. So that, so that eventually my art is so good that someone will put it into a AI generator to teach the AI, and then someone will AI generate with my art. I think you are already very good at I drawing. I like that. Thanks. You drew uh, eggs. Oh, I showed you my art, right? Oh, wait. I haven't shown you my sketchbook. No, I should have brought it to you. You drew me eggs <laughs> the other day, and they were really fucking good. Thanks. I think you have a good understanding of emotion and making images uh, oh, so expressive. Oh, someone said PewDiePie? Yeah. No, I already said on my stream... I was inspired by PewDiePie. I thought what he did was really cool. I don't know if you guys saw his video. He did a with, 100 Days of Drawing. With and the, he, the anime girls. Yeah, he did his improvement, and I, I thought it was really cool. I, I, used, I used to draw a lot, but I, I kind of stopped. So yeah, That's I cool. used to draw a lot, too, actually. It's fun. I used to do uh, in like the all the books in school. People would give me their books, and I would do like uh, stick figure fighting scenes and shit like that. That's like I used to the flip do, books? Yeah. That's so cool. Yeah, I, I did that to every single fucking book. And then I got in trouble, and I said, yeah, I did it. What's up? Yeah. <laughs> and then they were like, okay, well, <laughs> you know, it's like we're going to get new books. We don't have any money, so it is what it is. 
Damn. They're probably still using the books today. <laughs> Let me think. What else? What other ver like goals would I have? I don't know. I mean, like, to be happy, not to die, maybe find somebody, uh, get married, you know, something like that. That that's a good goal. You want kids? Maybe. Yeah. Sure. How many? I don't know, like, probably, I mean, you want to get more than one in case, like, it gets hit by a car or something like that, right? Yeah. So Maybe get, like, three, portfolio. hedge your bets a bit, because, like, what if one gets hit by a car, the other one's stupid, and then, like, maybe you have, like, one winner, Yeah, right? what, what if one's a girl? Well, that's what I said about. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah. Uh, anyways, yeah, I'm thinking about, like, one to three as well. I think that'd be cool. If you guys were the high school versions of yourself, do you think you would all be friends? No. Um, actually, like, I think that, I, I mean, I, I had a lot of friends in high school. I like, had fucking none. I, I had wait, tons of friends. why? I hated everyone. Oh my God. He was one of those kids. No, no, no. Okay. But I had a fucking reason. Okay. I wasn't like these other pussies who were like, oh, we're all black clothes. Yes, no, bro. you totally were, bro. I saw your haircut. No. Okay. I did wear all black clothes, but it's because I had a fucking reason. So, fuck no. I hated everybody. I hated everything when I was in high school. I would not be here. Fuck that shit, bro. My Dude, I was a fucking bitch. Dude, I had I, I would hang out with people all the time. What happened? Like, I don't know. Like, I, mean, <laughs> I don't know. I just got older, right? And it was yeah. just like, I guess I changed, maybe. Because, like, yeah, I remember we used to, like, go. It was, like, 8 in the morning. And we'd be listening to, like, Kanye West, like, Gold Digger. Like, just screaming at people on the way to school with like these <laughs> random kids that lived near me and they would be on the bus ride and then I would get to school and I'd hang out with my other friends. Dude, it was so fucking good. Yeah, I think I, I, I would have no problem like being friends with almost anybody back then. Yeah. I got along with everyone. I had a lot of different kinds of friends, but most of my friends were people that had similar interests to me. So like played the same games, like we would just go after school and play like rock band or whatever they're chill play games go eat but if tectone was mean which it sounds like maybe he was if he hated everyone it yep. would have been hard for me to be friends with him absolutely but maybe with asmin but you were like doing like questionable shit right what do you mean questionable shit well i don't know how much you've said publicly yeah that was a lot after <laughs> high school though I'm saying, like i was the kid who was trying to death note people <laughs> right? Like, oh no, no. We, we, I, 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 no, no. I mean, like the kid yeah. that would Death Note people in my school, um, he was doing that before Death Note came out. Number one. <laughs> oh, well, he. I remember he tried to kill me. Oh, okay. And because, uh, well, basically, I kept beating him in Smash Brothers because he lived next door. Yeah. And like he and I were good friends, and uh, he had a spear, and he was trying to stab me. And like kill me with the spear in the living room, and my dad was trying to read the paper, That's and insane. my dad told us to go outside. That is actually fucking insane. <laughs> Said Dylan, get the fuck out of the house. <laughs> you guys want to do that? Like, get out of the house. Got stabbed. What? If you actually got stabbed, he'd just been like, "Well, like get it out of there." Get, All right, well, we got to yeah. fucking call. So, Dylan, what the? F what are you guys doing? Stop just it. Pop a health pot. It'll be fine. Yeah. Yeah. No, there was that. There were a few other instances like that, too. So, But yeah, no, I was friends with him. Am, I, found am I supposed to read that one or no? On the right? Yeah. I think so, yeah. Oh, okay. Yo, this is a oh, thanks, man. This is a question from our Patreon, which is stakeandeggs.com forward slash Patreon. Uh, we got a question from the Patreon, which is stakeandeggs.com forward slash Patreon, which we'll be recording an episode later that you guys can go check out. Uh, since Emmy is training once a week at Iron Forge. Is it possible to get an MMA special with the three of you? Yes. But does that mean like we fight each other? Because I would, I would, that would be my last stream ever or my last episode ever. Why? Because you get charged for murder for killing us? Yeah. Obviously. Obviously. <laughs> uh, I don't know about doing MMA with other people. I'm not sure if I'm about that. What if you Maybe. Could, what if you could just watch? What if I could just sit there? You just watch. Maybe I'd do that. I'd be super down. I'm not about to get punched in the face, though. I'll tell you that. Oh, well, what I've been doing is just the training. So, like, shadow yeah. boxing, whole, like, teach the moves. I'll punch him. He's wearing, like, the foam mitts and stuff. Yeah, yeah. that's it's, okay. It's pretty fun. I don't like, think we would need to fight each other. Just, like, learn it. Okay. I mean, I don't yeah, think we can fight each other. We could. I could be on my knees and only use one hand. Versus you. 
Okay, we can do that. I think that'd be fun. You could, you could beat the fuck out of me. <laughs> <laughs> that'd be lit. Do you think people would make a hate thread of that, even though it's like we agreed to do That it? would be your most widely upvoted thread of all time. <laughs> they say, finally, somebody <laughs> fucking does it. Yeah, yeah. These guys deserved it for years. Yeah. <laughs> you could use a gun. <laughs> Oh no! I was saying that like you would still beat my ass even though you're using. One <laughs> <on> your <knee. laughs> oh, oh no, no! I don't think there's any way I win with one hand. That's insane. Can each of you say one compliment about each other? Wait, uh, this is the last no. question. No, dude. Why don't we just keep going, lol? True. We can do maybe a couple more after this. Yeah. yeah good. Yeah, that's okay. Good. Uh, let's see. One compliment. <laughs> As I said, I'm very, I'm honestly amazed at Emmy's ability to play games and not, uh, like, I used to, like, take my fingernails and pull my skin out. And, like, so Dude. I would just do that. And, like, so it's crazy that you don't do that because I do that. And even yeah. now, sometimes I feel like doing it. And, uh, so basically, you're saying that I'm normal. I think I'm normal. I think it's everybody else that's weird. Okay. But sometimes I wish that I was weird. I'm the only person that is normal. And Tecton, I think that you're you're so outgoing and positive. I I, I think that's incredible. It's great. I'm not. No, it, this isn't a backhanded compliment. Why do you look like you don't believe it? Yeah. I feel like I'm super not that. Well, you've got like roommates. You're always doing stuff with other people. That's you're true. positive. He's yeah. A friendly guy. Yeah, you are. Okay. I think it's a great thing. People get the worst image of Tectone, and he's such a good guy. Yeah. You, just, you can't believe it's a real call. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> that's right, guys. <laughs> yeah, that's right. That's right. Okay. Um, one of my compliments for Tectone, you're actually very good at cooking. Those greens that you made were good. The steak mm. was pretty good. There's something else that you made before that was good. Uh, wasn't the cake. The cake was ass. Not the cake. Well, he knows what he's talking about with cooking. Yeah. He is a very friendly guy. And Asmin, um, sometimes you don't sound like that much of an incel. Oh, that's not true. <laughs> you know that's a lie. <laughs> Look at her lying. That's what women do, you know? Yeah. <laughs> Finally, somebody says it. <laughs> and men being patronizing. Oh, here we go. Here uh -huh. we go. Uh -huh. <laughs> Uh, Emmy, I think you've done a very good job at overcoming the hurdles that have been put into your way, aka the anxiety. I think you've become oh, a very gifted speaker now. <laughs> okay, well, I don't know about that. I think so. I think, holy fuck. Listen. I do think I've gotten better. Like, I, people still talk about how, like, I'm very, like, awkward and anxious, but if you compare it to, like, two years ago, sorry, it's completely different. Well, no, it's like, it's like, for example, <laughs> if you were to put me in a room with Canute. Wake Wilder and the Mountain, right? I would look like a pussy bitch. If you were to put me in a room with any Minecraft streamer, I would look like a Giga Chad, right? Your issue is, is that you are constantly around some of the world's best streamers and world's best talkers. So even though you're a very good speaker, you just feel inadequate because of those who are around you. But you yourself are actually a very good entertainer. So this is the crazy Thanks. thing about it, right? It's yeah. like he found a way to compliment himself indirectly. <laughs> Right, because you see, I didn't like, even the think of that. I didn't even think <laughs> see, of that. I, see what he does? I was, Isn't I was, that cute? No, I was thinking about Ms. Kevin S. Fan on my life. I was thinking Ms. Kevin S. Fan. I was not thinking no, that, that at all. That is true. Yeah. Because most of them. Um, <laughs> that was not about me. Fuck, dude. A that's lot insane. of the streamers here <laughs> yeah. are very good and experienced at talking, whereas I was always just alone in my basement playing League. Yeah. And I'm also just naturally an introverted, quiet, very shy person. But I mean, I've been trying my best and I have gotten better and I'll try to keep getting better. Fuck yeah. You know. And I know people think that you're an, uh, an incel, Asman. I don't. I think uh, you're just saying the shit that nobody else wants to hear yet. <laughs> so I'll be real, bro. He's so based. Straight, I mean, straight up. We so got to tell it to him the way it is, brother. <laughs> yeah, straight up. I mean, I think it's like a nine, nine to one ratio of hit to miss. Yeah. Yeah. Last miss was the shower. That's okay. We'll get you on a skincare you routine. I missed the, oh, the shower. Uh, yeah. I mean, you say that, but it worked. I don't have the skin problems. As yeah, much but well, maybe you just have really good skin. We'll take you to soap land and we'll see which one you like more. Maybe you're like using the wrong kind of soap, or like maybe you weren't rinsing it off properly. Because if it you stays don't want on your skin, to know the clarification that I can give you for that, 
Do you want to know? I do. I mean, now you have to say it, right? I don't use soap. I literally take a knife and I <laughs> scrape the skin off of my face and off of my body. You should that. scrape your face off and then sell your skin to someone to wear as a mask. Okay. <laughs> like the <laughs> office. That's a good idea. Yeah. That'd yeah. be sick, bro. That'd be insane. Yo, by the way, yo, can I get some fucking soup? Can somebody bring me a soup? That'd be yeah. fucking nuts. Soup. Yeah. Oh, if you could instantly learn a new skill at the snap of your fingers, what would it be? New language, instrument, sport. Yo, go first. If you could instantly learn a new skill at the snap of your fingers. I mean, being able to speak Spanish or Mandarin again would be nice. Being able to play piano would be nice. That's a tough one. Piano? What do I mean? Like, oh, I would cool. say, like, I mean, could it be like, c could a skill be be able to fly? Well, I guess not, right? Probably not. Okay, so, uh, what skill would I want to know how to do? I would like to know. That's stupid. <laughs> What's stupid? Uh, what were you going to say? I was going to say to be able to code things, but now you have chat GPT. Well, you still have to... Don't like a lot of those AI generated things? Like, person has to go back and fix it anyway? Oh, yeah, but they'll figure that out. Okay. Yeah. I mean, being able to code would be cool, but... Kill, uh, killing well, all what, what would you want to code, though? I don't know. Like, I like could... A, a game? A viewbot? A viewbot? <laughs> okay. Uh, I, I, yeah, I, I'll have to think about it. Okay, so what would I want? Like, what kind of a skill would I want to have... I mean, I don't know. It would being good at a game would be good. That would be nice. Like being good at a game that matters to be oh, good yeah. at. Maybe I would be like, be like a, professional chef tier because then I could make anything I want to eat at any time. Oh, It'd really? Be like restaurant quality. Why would you do that? All you need to know is how to make a steak. Because I like eating things besides steak sometimes. Well, we can't all be perfect. Okay. So it's I <laughs> instantly learn a skill and I am the best of it or I'm my mediocre. I'm going to assume it's that I become the best person at this skill. Um, I think that would probably be uh, become the best Among Us player. Are you serious? Yeah, because I feel like it's... Uh, he wants to be a better liar. <laughs> that's what he no, wants. No, mm -hmm. because he that's, not how you be, play, that's not how you become a... Oh, he wants to be a better manipulator and yeah, gaslighter. There you go. Nah, I've already maxed that go. out. I've already, that's already maxed. Oh, my God. No, the way to win Among yeah, Us... Yeah, didn't you read the twit longer? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Which one? <laughs> yeah. Do you all think I tweet too much? Yes. Okay. That's okay, though. Do what you want. Yeah. So I think Among Us is about being able to tell the truth and getting people to believe that truth. Really? Yes, because whenever I would tell the truth, my teammates would know this guy's crewmate. And I think that's how you win in Among Us, is being very good at telling the truth. So it would avoid, whenever I were to tell the truth, if people were to just believe me immediately, that would be the best skill. Just people always knew when you were telling the truth. That would be fucking nuts. We'll do uh, we'll do one more, then we'll do the soup thing. How do you feel about that? Oh, I would love some soup. Okay. Uh, how do OTK meetings you actually play out? Is there a finance department for when y'all do larger events? Do you have an unofficial ranking, or does it run by seniority, etc., who's in charge? Oh, I got this one. I run everything. Oh, mm -hmm. okay. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> There's no one really, like, in charge. I mean, tips, like... Tips usually leads the meetings yeah, with like he he has the like the leader, agenda, I would but say. I don't like to. So this is like a personal thing, and anybody that's worked with me or been around me knows this. Like I don't like telling anybody what to do or having anybody follow an order or anything like that. Because I think if people do something that you want them to do that they don't want to do, they won't do a good job, and they'll just end up making it worse. So uh, <coughs> yeah, I, I think that generally it's just a collaboration as much as possible. And of course, we talk about finance, right? In terms of like planning out an event. Is this something that's worth doing? Is it's not? How feasible is it? How are we going to do it? How can we allocate resources? I mean, whenever you really break it down, there's a lot of things that even in such an odd you know, situation that we're in, uh, there's a lot of pretty standard things that you need to go through, right? You still need to pay people. You still need to you know, drive over there. You still need to manage logistics. And so... Yeah, it's really not that complicated. And uh, in terms of ranking for seniority or anything like that, uh, I, I think that one of the best things that we have about our leadership team is that 
we bring in a lot of people from different groups and like different mindsets. So, I mean, for example, like Emmy is going to have a totally different mindset on it than let's say S fan or I will. And I think that's just as valuable in a lot of circumstances and sometimes even more valuable depending on what the content is. Yeah. Well, they're asking like how the meetings play out. Most meetings, like I think that they think like we're just like talk constantly talking about money or like people are making big choices every meeting. Most of our meetings are like, we just get together we're like, okay, we're doing this this week. Good job, everyone. As fan, you need to fucking respond to your Discord DMs. Oh, yeah. And then we'll, like, sometimes we'll play test games. We talked a lot room. about games recently. Yeah, we've been playing a lot of games. Yeah. For the publishing company. That's right. That's going to be soon, guys. Yeah, that's been, like, 70% of the, 75% of it's the It's been a lately. very, very large percentage. Yeah, we have a big-ass big ass Excel spreadsheet with all the games. We'll just go through mm -hmm. and be like, that's cool. These that are the good meh. ones. These are the ones aren't so good. These are the maybes. <laughs> this, is the, this is the really good one. Mm. Exactly. So where's this soup thing? We gotta look at this. What, what's what's going on with this soup situation? Yo. Okay. It's one not ready minute yet. till we get soup. I Fuck got, yeah, bro. I, I love soup. Another bullshit. We get another question, or we can just pick one from chat ourselves. I. So did y'all see this <laughs> game? Uh, there's this game that came out. It's called uh, not came out. Get the trailer for it. It's called like Kingmaker or something like that. And it's hell like so yeah, hell brother. yeah. And so oh, this yeah. fucking game, like you need to watch the trailer. I don't want to spoil it for you because it's so fucking ridiculous, but you yeah. definitely need to watch the trailer for this game. It have is you nuts. ever have you ever experienced Don't tell her. <laughs> don't tell her. you're gonna well, fuck it up. Spoiler? You're gonna fuck it up. No, I mean, Wait, okay, you really you really up? wanna know. Well, I'll, I'll give so, you so basically think of a medieval <laughs> battle, right? Yeah. Okay. There's a uh, you know, a hundred soldiers marching across the battlefield. Yeah. And then the scene changes and it's a man driving a Toyota truck. And then the Toyota truck changes from being in a in a road to being on the medieval battlefield, running over the knights, killing them one after another, like it's Dead Rising from the Xbox 360. So it's like <laughs> Is it like a redneck man gets teleported back to medieval times? Well, you would think that Army of Darkness style. No, actually, and then there was a, even more. It's like so it shows a guy. And he's got like a sniper rifle, like a car 98. Yeah. Okay. And and he sees the officer, the king, and he just shoots him with the fucking sniper rifle yep. and he dies. Yep. And, then, and I... then there's knights running at you and the guy has an AK-47 and he's just mowing them down. Yep. It's amazing. And they have an Apache helicopter as a well. A literal attack helicopter yep. going down a medieval battlefield, just killing people. But what's the context of the Who story? cares? The context is, have you ever felt the power? Power of driving a Ford F-150. No. All real weird. No, that, no uh -uh, that was a Toyota truck, I can tell. It's Toyota? That was a Toyota truck. A okay. Ford F-150 would have hit two people and it would have fucked up. What? Is it not good? Damn. I mean, Toy think about it like this. This is what, you know, Hassan, like I said this whenever Hassan was on, and he went on like a whole thing about this. He was right, though, is that Al-Qaeda used Toyota trucks. Oh my God! If like, that shit, like if that shit can sustain, can withstand the fucking desert, the sand, and the United States military-industrial complex, it can deal with fucking anything. <laughs> it can deal with you know the Mississippi roads. So uh, Toyota is, it, is, is it, what it's Isikai about. Isakai or no? Isakai. Well, I don't think so. I, Isakai uh, implies I death and rebirth. Of. It's just teleportation. It's like time travel. Okay. Uh, and, oh, and then at the end of it, there is a little, there's a little Hello Kitty cat thing, and it's like a gotcha machine, Aww. and then it opens up, and it's all the skulls pour out from the people that you killed. Wait, it's a gotcha? Kind, well, it, it looks like a gotcha like machine. Like a slot machine? Well, no, it's like, the, the, I think it opens up, and then it like, a bunch of skulls pour out of it, but it's like really cutesy and everything. So it's I want, great. I need to address a chat member. So guys, real quick, I'm doing a, I'm gonna do a taste test of this here gamer soup. So, so this shit's actually real. Like whenever I saw them tweet this out, I thought, there's no way they actually gamer did this. Soups. I've already I need, been eating. I need, I need to address a fucking ones. dumbass in chat real quick. Who is it? Because they, this oh, one guy said, "Who the fuck eats soup with a fork?" Okay, bro. So if there's a bunch of noodles in oh, this yeah, it's cup, it's called gamer soups, but it's cup ramen. Yes. So if there's a fucking a bunch of noodles in a cup. If I eat all the noodles with the fork and there's a bunch of liquid in a cup, then I just Dude, fucking you don't, you don't, drink you the broth. You don't gotta be mean. It's just a misunderstanding. It's called soup. 
but it's noodles. Well, think and about soup. it like this: gamer sups, gamer soups. Would gamer yeah. noodles sound as good? No, it wouldn't. Let's they just be the, honest. They made the right choice. Yeah. Should I go for it? I would like to make one comment before I try this. Something that I noticed: this has seven grams of protein. What? Is that a lot? Seven grams of protein for 260 calories, and it's, uh, that's. I think that's pretty good, to be honest. Me personally, I've never seen ramen with more. <clears throat> Protein than Game, that. Gamer nudes. No. Oh, that's a good one. <laughs> yeah, I wonder why. Not a lot. That. Nothing. No, but that's more than I would expect from a cup of noodles. Me personally. So they have like flavoring. Did you put flavoring? Oh, go ahead. Sorry. Chicken. Chicken. I think they've got chicken, beef, and vegetable. The chicken ones were always my favorite for ramen. Mm -hmm. Chicken's the best ramen flavor. The beef was the second best, too, I would say. Chicken. Is it good? Have you not had these before? Bro. It just takes you back, you know? <laughs> being in college, being broke as fuck, but having the ramen, it just made you happy, bro. Fuck, I miss ramen. That shit's good as fuck. Gets the job done. It's good. Gamer, gamer, gamer soups. I gamer all soups. While y'all do your thing. I've uh, never had ramen that was cooked. I've only eaten it raw. No, that's actually good though. Like the, you crush it raw? up and then put the packet in it, right? No, you're doing it wrong. Well, what? actually, no, Wait, no, huh? you can do that. No, you can. Yeah, yeah, that's okay. Wait, what are you talking about? Because we used to then? crush it up. We used to put the packet in and then crush it up. But you could do it that way too. Oh yeah, same thing. Yeah, basically, and then you shake it up. And then you just eat out of yeah, that. Yeah, no, it's good. So you, you take a pack of ramen, you crush it up, you put the seasoning yeah. and shake it up, and it's like it's like chips. Exactly. Yeah, it's really, really good. Yeah. I would go in on that so hard. Yeah, there's there's some kinds of uh, ramen packs they make in Asia that are specifically meant to be eaten like that, like eaten mm -hmm. raw. It sounds weird, but it's actually good. So it's like, yeah, you can do that with this too, right? Someone said every asthma take is psycho. That's the one. Every <laughs> one. Every one. single. <laughs> everybody thinks I'm crazy, but the reality is that I'm the only one that's not crazy. I grew up thinking that I was crazy, and then I realized that no, it wasn't me. It was no, everybody you else. You are just crazy. What? It's not. No, I know it's not me. <laughs> I mean, what how? I said. Well, I wasn't listening. <laughs> I was crazy once. They put me in a room. Yeah? God damn, bro. I feel bad for y'all. Smells like, Y'all don't get this. Yeah. You're really liking that, aren't you? Oh, yeah. It's good, man. <laughs> it's good. Just watching Dick Tone eat. Yeah. It's good. It's nice, right? Y'all want some? No, I'm good. Oh, okay. Hey, uh, I'll be real. <clears throat> well, y'all want to wrap this shit up? Yeah, yeah we're going to wrap it up. That time. All right, guys, follow Emmy, follow Asman, follow my stream. Thanks for being here, guys. <clears throat> Hope you enjoyed yeah, the stream. We unfortunately have to end, even though there's more questions, because we're about to record our Patreon episode. Yeah, we have like 50. If we if we waited for all the questions to be over, this would be a subathon. So you guys have lots more. Make sure to uh, you know ask them whenever you can, and uh, you know in the comments of the videos, we always try to read those. And we want to say it's been a whole year that you've been watching Steak and Eggs. Oh, and uh, thank you guys so much for the support. Thank you. I can't even fucking believe it's been a year. What the hell? But it is. And so, yeah, huge shout out. Thank you guys so much. All of our production team. Everybody that puts up with my stupid ass every week. And everything else in between. Making all this stuff possible. Yeah. So, I hope you and, guys liked it. it. It was really fun. I yeah. wasn't really sure what to expect since we've never done a live episode, but I, I thought it was great. I really enjoyed it. I, I had fun. I did. I liked having chat on screen. Oh, by the way, let's uh, raid Seer, but um, don't send it yet, mods. But we're gonna. What's Seer doing? Playing Elden Ring, probably. Says Kungus is back, baby. Elden Ring first playthrough. Oh, he's fucked. Yeah, I watched him play a little bit yesterday. Yeah, it is rough. It is, it is a rough experience. You want to know why? It's not, it's not even that he's bad at bosses. It's that he is directionally challenged. He will not find the bosses. There's no way. We'll figure it out. 
I don't think so. I mean, I am too, and I beat the game oh, somehow. Absolutely same, but your level of that versus Sears is insane. So it's, it's an experience watching Kungus. Kungus. Well, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Uh, follow our streams, subscribe to the podcast. We post every Friday. Uh, this video is going to be going up tomorrow on the channel for people who didn't see it. <coughs> yeah, Tyke. <I'm dying. coughs> Well, guys, it's been really good. Make sure to follow us on uh, it's Twitch. Been it's been fun while it lasted. This yep. is Emmy's last stream. The and podcast so, is over. Yep. <laughs> and uh, if you, you want more, make sure to check out the Patreon, which That's Mods right. will spam the link is, to right how now. How is it episode 46 that we've been doing this for a year? Did we skip we that many? We skipped. That's what I said. We skipped that many? And there was also, I mean, yeah. Oh, specials too. Specials too. We only skipped like twice, I thought. There, so well, there, I th maybe. Yeah, I don't want to speak. There are probably some situations that caused it to happen. But yeah, thank you guys so much. I really appreciate it. And uh, well, if you're watching and you're just one of the average viewers, we'll see you all in the next one. And boys, peace. Bye.